Hey, Sausage Sleuth, it's me, the number one Sausage Sleuth, Joe, back here with Nancy Drew Donger on Decaption Island. We're here, and what we're doing is potentially finishing this game today. Do you know what that means? This might be oh, the last time I play a new mainline Nancy Drew game for the first time, except for the one that we don't talk about. Um, so, but I'll be replaying them. If you're here, please don't leave me. And then also, we'll be, we still have to play the dossier, the second dossier game. Oh, opened it up on a really serious note, didn't I? Let me just open up my notebook. It, it turns out I have something to do. What's the deal with the flags on the box on the beach? And open the darn thing. That's the next thing that I'm gonna be doing. In fact, today. Otherwise, I've done. Oh, oh, and look, I'm using this mug that Casey got me when I was sick. It says, can't check that off yet. Oh, it's the perfect day to use this mug. But in fact, I can check off a lot of these things because I've done a lot. Um, so it turns out, I think the plot of this game is an is a woman who lives in a shack alone, left bottles of stuff everywhere, and sent us to a secret island. Can I put it back? I, I didn't want to ride the bike. I'm just holding the... Oh, oh. If I take this off and then go somewhere, it's not in my inventory. Am I going to die? Oh, no, we made it. So I'm holding it, and that was fine. Well, I didn't want to go here, so let's go back. Um, I I need to go to the Hot Kettle Cafe because I think I know what's up with the flags. So she always wrote the word Rosebud on the things. Do y'all... On, pa on paper. And I think that there was a thing in here that said something about flags. And I remember seeing flags... And in fact, that reminded me of this thing. <laughs> it wasn't this, was it? No. So, and y'all, yeah, someone said it was Citizen Kane reference. I don't know who that is. Oh, here we go. Here we go, here we go. Oh, shoot. Should I have taken a picture of the box, though? Because I don't have the box. Is there a picture of the box on this guide? <laughs> uh, is there a picture of the box on Game Boomers? Beach. Go to the beach loaded with air holes. Deduce the letters. Go to the cafe. Rearrange, rearrange the letters to form a word. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. I understand this now. Oh, take a pic of the poster? Um, actually, I don't need one. I have one. I have a mental image of it. Y'all are like, y'all are ready for me to finish. <laughs> no, just as I suspect, just as I suspected, mama. Exactly what I thought, in fact. Now, someone has told me I can fall into the water at a particular point in time. <laughs> Actually, y'all don't know this about me, but I have a photographic memory in that I remember what photographs look like. Y'all don't know this about me? <laughs> I'm starting like this. <laughs> I'm in one of those moods, chat. It's gonna get weird. Wait, am I trying? Yeah, I'm trying to go to the, the place on the right. That's where, uh, oh, no, 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 go forward here. Yeah, 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 the beach is over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know why she looks down at the water so often. Just don't look at the water. Now, someone told me I can, what, jump into, jump on, jump into the... <gasps> If she... This is the Drew residence. Please leave a message at the beep. Hi, Hannah. It's Nancy. To make a long story short, I slipped on some rocks and have to come home. 
Could you please pick me up from the airport tonight? It's flight 323. Oh, and <gasps> three, two, three. Space, and some clean bandages. And you should probably run Three, two, three. Today. See you soon. The game just went full circle. The g we just got flight 323 from the other game. That's what you meant by the lore? Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Can I do that again? Wait. Oh! There's a certain path I can take? You are kidding me. This is the Drew residence. What's over there? Please leave a message at What's the over there? Hi, Hannah. It's Nancy. To make a long story short, I slipped on some rocks and have to come home. Could you please pick me up from the airport tonight? It's flight 323. Oh, and <laughs> she jumps like a lizard person. And some clean bandages. I have to and tell you, you rent a um, too. see you soon. Uh, Nancy Drew dies in a foot of water. Fell in a foot of water, dead. Dead. <laughs> the other game that was 323 was, what was that, Blackmore Manor? Was that Blackmore Manor? I remember there was a, was it under the seaweed? How would this even still be here? So it spells Rosebud, which I know. Maritime words in order. And type the alphabet. Oh, yeah. So it spells Rosebud. <laughs> R-O-S-E-B. Oh my God, Bud. Hey, bud. I don't know what all those letters mean, but something tells me this may come in handy. A cat wrote this. Here. This is a note from the cat. Can I not take it with me? Oh, I can. Congratulations. I hope you enjoyed finding this. Oh, it's from Hilda's. Tilda's. Tilda Swinton's. Twin sister, Hilda Swinson. <laughs> sure, I've got a secret. Well, two actually. But I don't believe in just handing things to forks on a... What is this? Oh, folks on a silver. God. And for what I want you to send me, read the little story I've enclosed. That'll get you started. The story makes no sense, you say? Well, you got into this chest, didn't you? Anyway, eventually you'll find the answer to my first secret. Psst, 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 psst. As for my other secret, if you're smart and I have a thing in the mean you are, you'll figure it out along the way. Something is fishy in Snake Horse Harbor. Why couldn't she read the rest of me? Because I am having so much trouble reading this font. Anyways. <laughs> oh, and no funny stuff because I'm watching you. Imagine your signature being this fucking ugly and then you draw this. <laughs> fucking chill. Something fishy and snake horse harbor. Oh, I never did predictions for who I think it is, by the way. It's one of the men. If I'm being honest. It's one of the, it's not the barista. She literally, she has opinions, but I don't think she really cares. Um, it's one of the two, there's three people it could be. I guess she could have, I guess Katie Firestone could have done it herself, but I don't know. She, she seems too simple. <laughs> she seems too simple to have done that. The only one I see as being super conniving is um, the guy who owns the museum. But you never know. The fisherman could be snaky too. You literally got a 50-50 chance. I lean towards the museum guy. His reasons though are super obvious, so who knows. There once was a dog named Alpha who lived high in the Sierra Nevadas. The dog weighed about 100 kilos and lived in a hotel in the Sierras. Alpha loved his owner, Juliet Smith. Juliet belonged to the Delta Gamma <laughs> Is this some sort of fucking fan fiction that a that a 
That's, that a college student wrote. Julia belonged to the Delta Gamma sorority. Go Gamma Delta! Delta Gamma! And loved to dance the foxtrot. Her boyfriend was named Oscar, and he was quite a Romeo. One day, the owner of the hotel decided to move the India this is the to raise lima read. beans. That was fine for Miss Smith because she wanted to live in the Delta Gamma house. But Alpha wanted to stay in the Sierra Mountains so he could learn to play golf. The owner eventually moved to India, and even though she loved a foxtrot, Miss Smith became a tango instructor. Okay, what I'm really trying to say is... <laughs> this is this story brought to you by Delta 8 THC. Hilda Swinson, hold up. Why is it, it called Tango? Where are they going? It should be called Tang Stop. Do you know? <laughs> okay, so I'm seeing a lot of, um, okay. What I'm seeing is, oh, it says there are merit. Oh yeah, this is, um, I have to go back to the cafe. Can I bring this with me? Oh, thank God. Is there anything else in here? I can't. Yeah, she said I don't Sending fucking want this. From the top of the lighthouse in oh, I didn't read. Code? I didn't read the bottom of the first page. <laughs> to get anywhere in this world, you got to get out there and be curious. Nobody wants to work these days. Hilda Swinson said nobody wants to work these days. You got to ask questions and shake things up till you get answers. And I know you're curious, or you wouldn't be reading this. So what I, what I want you to do, I want you to sit down, I want you to shut up, and I want you to learn something. Read the little story. Oh, so I have to read the story, translate it, and then Morris code it to her. God. Honestly, we need to do, what's that Netflix movie that Trixie and Katya watched where they, <laughs> they took all the old woman's possessions and it was like a con and they like raided her house, but then it turns out she had ties to the mafia. I care a lot. Is that the name of it? Thank you so much, Jello baby. I care a lot. Let's just I care a lot her and then just take all this then we can get in her house. <laughs> Cosmos, thank you for the bits by the way. Kick at Moss, thank you so much for the bits. Gigi, thank you for the bits. She a flop the greatest film on earth is Padding. I did see Paddington too. Kick at Moss, thank you again for the bits. I appreciate that. Did I just go back to the beach? Oh, no, no, no. This is... Look, I don't need GPS. Let's just talk to Katie real What's quick. Up? Oh, never See mind. See you in a bit. Be careful out there. Don't tell me what to do. Um... Uh, uh, Becky Jacks, thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate that so much. Yo, it's so hard to get off this boat. All right, I'm going to bike to the cafe, back to the cafe. <laughs> Gigi, thank you for the bits again. Hi, Godric. Laura Lennox, thank you for the nine months. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Azu Wazu, thank you for the two months. And my assault. Oh, my God. 31 freaking months. Math. Math? I d pretend I don't even see it. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. So look at this. Here's the situation. I need a notebook. Exclamation point merch in the chat. It's my, oh, oh, just my official sausage sleuth notebook. <laughs> Hold on. I got to flip past my therapy notes. Okay. Fresh page, fresh page. <laughs> Thank you, Monica. Thank you, Thursday. 
<laughs> We're on a trip today, y'all. I'm here to have fun. Okay, let's look at the, the letter. Is Sierra and Nevada's part of the code, too? Sierra and Nevada's. Uniform Victor... Ro Sierra! There's Sierra. So, Foxtrot, Echo, Golf... Oh, my God. So, all of the letters that are in the International Communication Alphabet... Which... Is that a real thing? Are the ones I have to write down. So, we got Alpha... Oh, that's an A. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. They just court. No, that doesn't. Yeah, they all correspond to the first letter. Oh, I got it then. Alpha. Sierra. Kilos. Ask. ASK. Ki cocaine. Alpha. Loved his owner, Juliet Smith. Lived in a... Ho oh, was Hotel one of them? Hotel. Ask Ha... 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 Juliet Smith. S Juliet... Ha... Hotel is one of them. It's right. It's H. H is hotel. Um, kilos. Alpha loved his owner, Juliet Smith. Whoa, whoa, wait. Sierra's not one, right? Oh, oh, it. Oh, it is. Because I said it the first time. Ask. Hotel Sierra's. A, J, J, D, G, F, R. It says ask something for, but I got that word wrong, I think. Oh, no, I didn't. Ask H, S, A, J, J, D. Oh, Gamma's not G, is it? No, it's golf. So it is just a bunch of nonsense letters. HS is who? Hannah? Oh, Hilda Swinson. AJ would be Allison Janney. And JD would be... Um, Who's the celebrity with JD? Oh, I have to enter it on the sheet. Okay. Yeah, we started playing already. I got things to do. Jack Daniels. JD Salinger. Jason Derulo. Jinx Donsoon. <laughs> Not all of this. Okay, so we got that for Oscar English Choir Room. One day, the owner of the hotel for H I. So L is, L is one, L, Delta, Alpha, oh, okay, Alpha, all right, I'm just looking at this one, Hilda's Gift, ask HSAJJD for Hilda's Gift. HS. So far, so good. Oh, I'm not sure. I'm going to be going to be going to I did. So the parts that I did on my own were ask and then the nonsense and four. And then I just wrote down Hilda's gift. Nancy's trying to do ASMR or something. I'm getting there. Ta-da! Ask H S A J J D for Hilda's gift. Ask Hope 
Andy and Jenna for Hilda's gift. What? Andy, does she know their last names? Oh, those are the three people I know, right? You again? <laughs> Wait, that's all three people who are in the game. That's all three people in the game. I'm pretty sure I saw a couple of dead Atlantic herring on the beach earlier today. Is that possible? Nope. Oh, Nancy, yeah, Andy Pacific Jason. Herring, not Atlantic herring. No way. So the the one person who locked herself in her cabin just told me to ask the only people in town. But they matched the picture I saw in that postcard over there perfectly. Because Atlantic herring are found only in the Atlantic. Trust me, I spent five years fishing for him. We catch Did him I find the Atlantic freezer, herring? Sell him to aquariums and such. To aquariums? You mean to feed to other fish? Or to sea mammals? Of course. What else would they do with him? Bring him back to life and put him on exhibit? Look, I don't know how it is where you're from, but up here seeing two dead fish on a beach isn't exactly front page news. Let it go. Did I see dead fish on the beach? I don't remember that. I feel like I would have... I did? Oh, I did. Yes, you did. <laughs> yes, you did. I understand that Hilda Swenson... I tried to touch them? So what if she did? Were they frozen? Dead fish. Oh! Oh. One set of foot... <laughs> it's true. Oh, man, that concerns me about my memory. I was hoping I could take a look at it. <laughs> you sure are a demanding little thing, ain't you? But tell you what, this chess problem I've been working on is giving me fits. Here, solve it for me, and I'll let you see what Hilda gave me. Okay, lotion all over those to look at the chess book little sausagey fingers. Help, let me know when you're through. Um, y'all don't know this about me, but you do because I've told you several times. I have two trophies in life. I've only ever won two trophies. No, that's not true. Three. But one of them was made out of trash. Two real trophies and then one that came with a certificate. But it wasn't really the reward. Anyway, the two trophies. <laughs> one was for knowing my multiplication tables and doing 100% on all my multiplication tables in third grade the second one was for chess and that was in middle school i played chess so what has he got in here which that doesn't mean i'm gonna do this and do this well but okay, this isn't scopa so i don't know why i would want that See, I when I opened up that other book, I immediately knew that that wasn't chess because I have a chess trophy. Oh, pff. oh, three, four, seven, five. Oh, well, that might mean something. Oh, that's probably the combination to the lighthouse or something. I don't know. Only, only someone who has a chess trophy could understand the difference between chess and poker. Those pieces move like that? I'm just kidding. I want to play chess again. I miss it, but no one will play with me. I even recently bought another chess board. Identify two moves that white can make to win the game. R is rook, K is... Oh, so I'm doing it in notation to win the game. Well, she'll just say things if I want. Okay, so we need white to win the game. Is that their king? That must be their... Yeah, because they don't have another one. Okay. So for white to win the game, I would say that in fact... You knock over the board. <laughs> A 
And that's how I got my trophy. Oh, do the queen's giblet pose. And then the vibrator tells me which pieces to move. Did y'all hear about that? <laughs> Taylor Jeff. I don't even know if it was an allegedly situation. Did y'all hear about the chess scandal with the vibrator? We're not even going to talk about it. You can look it up. It's all allegedly. Now, what I had done to win might shock you. So, I would probably move... Uh oh, um, but then they're going to get to move too. Oh, I mean, I could, I would win immediately is what it's saying. Oh, okay. Um, if the queen, oh, hey. if. <laughs> Nancy, put it back together. Jesus. Um, this is my queen. Oh, this is the king. That's useless. So let's say... Yo, I haven't played chess in a long time. <laughs> you know, I haven't played chess in a long time. So I think we could do Good. move piece queen to uh, d6. Correct. Queen moves to d6. So black would move here. Wait, was that correct? Oh, so she's moving their pieces, too? Oh, that's not good. Oh, and then if I move the queen there, I would... I would win as well. I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's move queen... Perfect. to... d8. Yes! There! Checkmate! I didn't even look that up. Mama. Oh, I hit the wrong one. I just earned my chest trophy all over. I'm going to dig that out. I think it's, I think we have it here. I'll dig it out for the next stream. <laughs> Not the vibrator. Accidentally calling Ned. Imagine how tired my chat is. Y'all are like, can y'all please fucking end your last Nancy Drew game Check already instead Red of milking it? And to keep up my end of the bargain, here's what Hilda gave me. Handles made of scrimshaw. She carved it herself. <laughs> what? Never would tell me why she wrote one bum on it like that. Of course, this was after her husband died. Yes, her mind was starting to go. Thanks for letting me see it. See you around. Watch out for Caddy. For who? Caddy Herring? One bum. My chat begging me to finish this game today. <laughs> After all this shit. Hi, Nancy. How's it going? Did Hilda Swenson give you something? She made a necklace for me. Prettiest thing I own. I'd show it to you, but it's at my house. How did you know she gave me something? It's kind of a long story but I'd really love to see that necklace. Problem is, my home's across town, and I'm real low on clams, which means I've got to go clamming before I can even think about doing anything else. I'm not going to offer to go clamming. But I really need to see that necklace. But I really need to see that necklace. Okay, if you get the clams, I'll go get the necklace. Oh, it was you a trap. In here. Fifteen ought to do it. That's the limit anyway. There's a limit? But you also need a permit. Andy Jason can issue you one. It's been fun talking to you. Back at ya. Eh. Fun is a lot. <laughs> we don't use fun loosely around here. <laughs> STF Unicorn, thank you for the 11 months. Uh. I appreciate that. Gigi, thank you for the bits again. Oh, is the crab in the duffel bag? That'd be wonderful. Oh, I need to go get the permit. 
Well, I'm getting my I'm getting my steps in. Froggy girl, thank you again for the bits. Voodoo Sparkle Juju, thank you for the bits. Uh, good to see you. Small squall. Not bums, clams, and vibrators. Thank you so much for the bids. And I see the cosmos! Oh, Animal Crossing. Animal Crossing. Thank you so much for the bids. Well, I'm getting my steps in on the bike. I'm getting my, what do you call that? My movement. You have to get your intensity minutes. You gotta get your intensity minutes. Neon gummies, thank you for the bits. And okay, Caitlin, thank you for the bits too. I appreciate that. Hi, Nancy. I understand that Hilda Swenson gave you a present? She gave me the design I used to create the keychains I give away to everyone who goes on a Whale World Whale Watch. She was quite the graphic artist. Oh, I never got my free keychain. You little shit. Since I took your whale watching tour, I get a free keychain, right? Actually, I only give them to paying customers. Now, why did the term false advertising suddenly pop um, into my head? My dad's okay, a lawyer. Okay. Remember how my dad is a lawyer and I have the Better Business Bureau on speed dial? Whitney, thank you for the bits. My body battery was 50 this morning, which is better than it has been. It needs to be in like the 80s when I wake up, but I'll take 50. It's going to be a long day, too. I got to do the podcast later, too. I need a clamming permit. But I feel Can good. I could get one from you? Ordinarily, you could. But Can't check that off yet. And I'm kind of busy right now. Of course, if someone wanted to volunteer to help me. What do you need me to do? What kind of help do you need? Inside that box marked Caddy is a miniature of what our resident sea monster might look like in skeletal form. Assemble it for me, and I'll not only give you a permit, but I'll throw in a free clam tube. And remember, whales rule! Not a clam tube. This thing? Oh, that's fucking easy. That's a wiener. <laughs> this here is its wiener. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the Loch Ness Monster wiener. Good. Is there a drawing I can look at to do this? Or am I just really smart? Oh, shit. Oh, garbage. It, it put it all up. Bingo. I can do this. I know how to do this. Bingo. Hmm. That's not right. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. We get it. All right, let's start tucking the tail in. Oh yeah. I have game boomers to help me if I need help, but I think Oh yeah. I think I know how to put together a sea monster. Nah. I don't know. That kinda looks like a neck. Oh yeah. Y'all, I've been to the I've been to the National History Museum. Phlebotanist, there's a big play structure of this thing at Cadboro Bay in Victoria. Like in real life? Thank you so much for the bids. Dobby Day! Thank you for the bids. We should be finishing today, allegedly. Allegedly. Uh, and AJ Brunaham, thank you for the six months. It's great to see you. Nah. Thank you, thank you. Nah. I like nah. when I set it down here. She's still... Berates me. Nah. Does the tail have bones? Mm. Oh. Hmm. This one? Oh my god. Hmm. This does go here. Good. She's a fucking hater. She's a hater. And something goes here. I'm just taking a little peek. 
Don't worry about it. Good. Um, this definitely doesn't go where I think nah. it goes. Hmm. Nah. Oh, I'm nah. missing a piece. Bingo. In real life, you does not want to play today. Well, I just, I just think that dinosaurs are dead for a reason, <laughs> and it's because people. Ah! <gasps> oh! <gasps> Do you know? Do you know how close? Clicking the clicking this bone and clicking the back arrow are millimeters. Millimeters, mama. Nah. Bingo. I'm writing a letter. I'm writing a letter. Oh, I don't even have a senator. I live in DC. Bingo. <laughs> I don't even have representation I can yell at. Hmm. Where's the government nah. official that I can call? When something goes wrong. Nah. Hmm. Bingo. Uh, she had had it today. Good. Now the neck. Oh, that's scary. Oh, yeah. These things are very close. Good. This flapper. Good. I'm going to click some of the, look at this one. That is a, the scariest, oh, yeah. scariest click in the game. Good. Did it really only have like 15 bones? That's wild. <laughs> Y'all, that's wild. We evolved all these bones Bingo. and they only had like 15 bones. Oh, yeah. Bingo. Hmm. <laughs> nah. Okay. Nah. If you say so, Diva. Nah. Good. I almost clicked back again. Wow. Am I a creative genius or what? Um, so that's the test you have to take to get your clamming license. Oh, Trick. let me look at this. Wonder what that means. Trin. She was trying <laughs> this. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is the fucking flop of a fucking keychain that she designed. Graphic designs her passion. And she just and they never question why there's just Random fucking letters all over it. They never question this. They just hand them. Well, no, no wonder they're giving them out for free. Hi, Nancy. Mama. I finished putting that. No wonder. Together. So you did. Caddy never looked better. Here's your permit, and here's your clam tube. Look for little holes in the sand. Sometimes water will squirt out of them. Anyway. Center the tube over the hole, push it down into the sand, and pull. If you're quick enough, the clam will be in the sand that comes out of the tube. If not, try, try again. The clam will be in, in the Thanks sand. Thanks for your time. Okay. Drop by again. <laughs> I'm too immature for this. That's what they... They suck clams out of the ocean with that? Out of the sand with that? They pump those clams out? You want to get pumped? Okay, Cat Moss, thank you for the bits again. I appreciate that. Just a not She stops at every location, too. Good for her. You need to take breaks. Oh, yeah. Didn't y'all have a crush on Andy Jason? I can see your pickle. I see your silver. Oh, yeah. Y'all had the hots for Andy Jason. That's not on me. That's on y'all. Aha! 
I have to, and I have to do that 15 times. I saw these dead fish last time. God, why is the music so emotional? No, do I really have to do this? It takes so long. Oh my God. So I just have to keep walking back and forth to all these clam holes? You're kidding me. How long does it take for the clams to respawn? Hey, full-time idol. How long does it take for clams to respawn? They don't respawn, do they? Leave the area and come back. There's a cheat way to get clams. Oh, okay. There's two locations. Maybe I should look somewhere else for a while. I bet they're at that awful beach too, right? Mmm. I can go to the... You're talking about the, the beach that's like over here, right? The secret beach? I hated going there, so... I'll just go to Katie's. I'll yell at her, and then I'll drive back. Do you think they respawn that fast? They do respond, it just takes a while. Kick at Moss, thank you for the bits again. I appreciate that. Gigi, thank you for the bits as well. So it takes them a while, huh? So I might as well. Well, wait a second. I think I can break into the lot house. What was that? Whoa, that was close. I thought it was gonna be that guy from the museum game jumping off a roof again. <laughs> that guy loves jumping off roofs. Y'all. Yeah. So would that have killed me? I assume that would have killed me if I had picked up the rocks. Stand on the beach and make a clam call. There was what's a clam call? A clam call? <laughs> Henrik jumped. We all know it. <laughs> Not this. Three, four, seven, five. I'll do this for now. <laughs> oh, shh. I wonder what that did. <laughs> okay. I pulled that lever. I'm sorry. Lighthouses have stairs, don't they? Looks like someone's been up here recently. Someone messy. Someone's been a messy baby. <gasps> Is that a Coco Kringle bar? That's today. Wonder why it's circled. Nancy learns about calendars. That's today. I wonder why today's on the calendar. Why would today be on a calendar? Looks like the bulb is missing. What's today doing on a calendar in a small town like this? <laughs> I'm it's about to eat my shut. my cyanide sandwich. It's rusted shut. Can't you hit it with something? 
A rock. It's rusted shut. That would have worked in real life. Sam property. Oh, that's Morris type. But, but, but in. Oh, it's period and dash for to go dot and dash. I don't have any message to send. I don't have any message to send. I can't even, I can't even eat the candy bar. Today? On my calendar? Oh, I thought he was going to be there. Now, this thing around the corner. Oh, there's a basement. Oh, that's probably what the lever did. All right, got it, got it, got it. I found a light bulb. Oh. She can only carry one light bulb at... Do they all... Oh my god. Does only one of these light bulbs work? Take the box, Steva. You might want to game boomer the light bulb part. Eat the light bulb. Only one works. Do you crunch them usually? Clamming. Look for clams. Hot cattle cafe. Tunnel. Lighthouse. I'm not even supposed to be here yet. <laughs> sea serpent, sea cat, lamp. Place the light bulb on the back lid of the lamp. Oh, I don't. I'm doing this out of order now. I'm doing this really out of order. I wonder why that's there. I don't think I know how to do that yet. Now, what did that say? Through the efforts of many... Built the wall scene here. It's just a lot of people built the wall. I don't have... I can't do this yet, right? No. Oh, okay. okay. Well, that's good. That's good to know. Can I just leave them all? Can I just want to put it back. <laughs> I wanted to put... Oh, I put it back. Okay, good. Okay, I there's no need to scream. I'm going to slowly back away from the lighthouse. I'm going to see if any more clams happened. And I think I'll just go to the other beach. Now, were y'all joking about the clam call? Or were you saying if I make, like, a phone call, they'll come back? I never called the Hardy Boys, did I? Hello? Hi, Frank. It's Nancy. Hey, Joe, lock her up and then get to a phone. It's Nancy. He's oh, you were trolling else? me? Gold. That person She's was joking. A someone. She's a something. Hey, Nancy. How's life in the Pacific Northwest? Well, someone ransacked Katie's boat uh -huh. just before I arrived. Wow, that's great. They gave Joe mega twink voice. Me, my voice. I knew you were gonna say that. She's got a mystery to solve. She's supposed to be on vacation. Crime never takes a vacation, Frank. Joe is so gay-coded. We need to lean into it. What was that? That was that a dog. Was She's this dog Yay! Her owner to come get her. That's I want to guys. see the dog. Well, unfortunately, there's a problem. She's not housebroken? She's as big as an SUV. Fully loaded. She's in the garage. I'm upstairs. That's how big her bark is. Aww. So you can imagine how big she is. Was there a reward out for her? That's the good news. We're talking triple digits. Wow. Enough about us. Let's hear what you've been up to, Nancy. Not holding the dog hostage. 
to get to the water. The bulb is a seal. Oh, uh, bye. See you later. Call us anytime. Yeah, it's a pretty sure bet we'll be here. Oh, because they're sad and have nothing to do. Oh. <laughs> Holding the dog for ransom, Mama. Hello? Hi, Bess. Can you talk? Hey, Nancy, of course I can talk. I think she just wanted to make sure nothing on the stove was in danger of igniting. Everything's safely on simmer. What's up? I found a letter. Have any of you guys been clamming any... I had to fix the shutter. The bulb. Oh, so I basically ask them the same question? I better get going. Yes. Do you smell something burning? Shoot! Bye, Nance! Why don't they play? Yeah, why don't they play with the dog? I love dogs. I got to play with a uh, golden retriever last night, and it was... Oh, Piggy was upset. When I got home... Piggy smelled, Piggy sniff sniffed, and he said, where have you been? He said, where do you think you've been? I gotta play with a golden retriever and a corgi. <laughs> Piggy was, sniff sniff, where the hell have you been? Piggy got so spoiled with T-R-E-A-T-S. He always gets like he it seems like Piggy always wants to he wished he would have could have played with them too. Oh. Dogs always know when you've seen another dog. Y'all, I know how to get to this beach. Y'all might y'all don't know this about me. <laughs> but I have a kayaking license. Oh shit. Where's my clam plunger? Five down, ten to go. You're kidding me. They really made her find this many. I have a question. What is across there? What's over? What's over there? And do I need to actually to build a sandcastle? I could use a break. <sighs> Time to go back to work. More clan. I tried to jump the rocks and I died. Yeah, yeah, dear chat, y'all can tell me. Are there, like, infinite crabs? There didn't seem to be very many crabs on this beach. Imagine me sucking that fish up through this pump. There's a clam over there. Just one? A little sandbar with more holes. Are you kidding? Oh, no, 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 here's one. Malone's bones. Nancy eats that. Two, they are required. Oh, so I have to get those ones? Oh. Oops. All right, I'll jump over there. No clams here. How is it possible for there to not be. I need this many clams, and there's no clams? Haters. The haters are out tonight, divas. Oh, it was a ghost dog's Easter egg. I knew, yeah, I knew that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, yeah, I remember all the games. Well, yeah, yeah. More than halfway there. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember. Okay, let's do it. I remember I, I'm going to save it right here. Well, it'll give me a second chance, but. Well, clams are kind of like the potatoes of the sea. If you think about it. And I do. So last time I tried to jump on that one. I guess I'll try to jump on this one. I guess I should be trying to jump on the big ones. You're kidding me. 
trash. Nope. That is not what the ground looked like, right? Are you kidding me? Just dead shit. Am I, am I holding on to this shit? Nope. You're kidding me. Y'all are kidding me. Did y'all fucking... Y'all are joking me, right? Is it random? <laughs> I'm gonna puke. They're... So they're all random? You're kidding me. And that's it, too. Just... Shit. I'm gonna die on this beach. That's the exact same shell I just found. Oh, this beach has a lot more. Oh, I've got two of these! Y'all, this is getting weird. Yeah, the water is like a f not even a foot deep, it looks like. Those ones seem to, those clam holes seem to uh, respawn really fast. I might just stay on this island. <gasps> I would eat... Well, I... I don't like crabs, but I'd eat it. You have to check them a few there times. you are, my pretty. What was that? Nancy has snapped in this game. Nancy snapped. All right, I'll jump back across. That will not be a sound button. There's one. Thirteen. It's really reassuring. She that I just know she's gonna continue doing the math for me, and I appreciate that. One more clam, I mama. More clams. Maybe I should look somewhere else for a while. One more clam, mama. She is really brave. Like she is. You would get a concussion. If you slip and get a concussion on the secret beach and all no one right. can find you, clams. dead. All set. Yeah, she was the main voice of the, of the America's Next Top Model game. Fiona Lofi, oh my gosh, with the 15 months. Thank you so much. Snow Leopard X, thank you so much for 10 months. I appreciate that. And Whitney, oh, oh I didn't even see. I didn't think you backseated. Thank you for the bits, though. <laughs> and Gigi, thank you for the bits, too. I appreciate that. Um, uh, if I'm being honest, America's Next Top Model game got so repetitive, I just couldn't do it anymore. The water looks delicious. I can smell this water. It just... None of it looks good. It was the same thing every episode with like a little bit of storyline, but it was mostly wake up, eat fruit, do your outfit theme, cry, slap someone, work the runway. <gasps> Where the hell did he go? Drugs. Oh. Really? Where did he go? Is he pissing? I better give Jenna the clams she asked for before I go. Oh, she asked for the clams. I'm sorry. Hi, Nancy. Oh, good. You got the clams. Let me take those from you. 
I'll take that clam tube off your hands, too. You'll never guess what happened. While I was home getting that necklace for you, somebody broke in here. The sheriff just left. Uh, really? Really? Was anything stolen? What's weird is I'm not only missing food, like bread and eggs and stuff like that. No worries, Shell but Cottages. It looks like they also stole a bunch of tools and some boat parts. Boat parts? Boat parts. Go figure. Katie? More, both doors were locked when I got here, and none of the windows were broken. It's like a ghost did it. Would it be okay if I looked around? If you want to play detective, please be my guest. If you have any questions, just holler. I'll get to the bottom of it. Boat parts? There's two people in this town who have boats. Three, in fact. <laughs> Katie? Everyone except you, actually. Katie, Andy, and the fisherman. In fact, everyone has a boat. <laughs> That's strange. Someone spilled salt? What's strange about that? Kids kids do that shit all the time. It's probably kids. Stupid ones at that. <laughs> probably kids. Stupid ones. I won't let our lighthouse become a dark house. <laughs> Hilda Swinson, the mayor. Oh my god. Y'all, I'm literally seeing this in a 640 by 480 window. This game's not 800 by 600. This game is 640 by 480. When I tell you, I'm... I hate reading this. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Nancy thinks salt is strange. She's not used to seasonings. Phlebotanist, thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate that so much. Smoke Horse Harbor owes its life to Lloyd House that stands beside the channel. The men and women who built it in 1866 realized that a Lloyd House would not only warn sailors of the rocky shoals nearby, but it would also advertise their little town's existence. Its revolving oil lamp would announce to the world, We're Snake Horse Harbor. <laughs> Come, stay. Help us build a thriving community. And thousands did just that. Today, the shows are gone. And many people think we ought to start discouraging people from moving here. To some, the lighthouse is a useless, dangerous eyesore. Tearing it down would be too expensive, so they want to just let it fall down. As if that wasn't bad enough. They want to turn off its light for good. I just assumed Hilda Swenson was from, like, New York. <laughs> oh, we're not in Maine, though. We're on the other coast. Is this New York, Boston, or Jersey? It's kind of a pick one. Oh, she's from L.A. Yeah, we, well, her parents are from the East Coast, though. But that's not going to happen. If I fall in my current affairs, uh, 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 legend chain, a uh, landmark, help the people. Okay, so essentially she just didn't want to knock the lighthouse down. I don't know, maybe get a different hobby. <gasps> Did they still put any clams or potatoes? That's weird. <laughs> Save King. Looks like they didn't take all her boat parts. How? I can't see that at all. Save King? She must have got a great deal. And Save King. <laughs> Looks like you do a lot of shopping at Save King. I do all my shopping at Save King. Looks like you do a lot of your shopping at Save King. Hey, I do all my shopping at Save King. That's the commercial for Save King. What do you mean? I do all my shopping at Save King. <laughs> Brought to you by Save King. 
How come you store bulk parts in here? Gotta store them somewhere. It's a closet, a Nancy. I barely have a closet and my boat breaks down a lot. It's a closet, Nancy. She puts stuff in the closet that goes in the closet. What was that? I'm just clicking the same thing again, aren't I? I don't know why I started doing the accent. We're just gonna have to roll with it. I keep hearing people eating in here and I haven't seen a single... I keep hearing like forks on plates. Do y'all hear that? And no one's eating or drinking. Oh, I remember this. I don't... Oh, that's poker! Is that poker? I think that's poker. Oh, no. I don't know how to play poker. I have a chess trophy. <laughs> I have a chess trophy, not a poker trophy. Is that it? This is all that this room was? I thought this room was going to be nice. Oh, your restaurant is shitty. You live like this? Hi, Nancy. How's it going? Do you have that necklace you said you'd go get? Well, sort of. My niece got hold of it last time she was out here and locked it up in some kind of toy box. It's on the table over there if you want to try to open it, because unfortunately, I can't. Oh, sorry. I was reading a text. I got it all done. Up in some kind of toy box that's on the table. Over oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, something about a muffin. It's been sure. Fun talking to you. Later, Gator. I'm not an alligator. You just left it on a table. What table? She said a table over there. Oh. Match pairs across all three screens. Well, I knew that wasn't right. <laughs> Uh-oh. Do I have infinite chances? Do I have infinite chances? <laughs> she can't... Jenna, y'all... Jenna struggles with the matching game. I have infinite tries? Oh, okay. Wow. This is really happening. Oh, shoot. I don't remember where the cake is. There it is. She, yeah, maybe she has a short attention span. Oh, come on. Hey. This is like those, um, do y'all remember those voice activated, like, kids' diaries? That were so easy for any, like, they were cheap. The voice, anyone could open them. Where the, was that mushroom? <laughs> you had one? I wanted one. I wanted one so bad, but they were, they were, that it was a very gendered toy and it was marketed towards girls so i couldn't ask for one let your kid have whatever toy they want um i'm sure my parents would have got it for me if i had wanted it i played with barbies but it was one of those um i think i stole my sister's barbies oh i'm not paying attention everyone can play with any toy okay I just want to announce that. And I, I wanted that so bad. <laughs> How many times will I click the radish? Use the password max from the commercial and was so P.O. <laughs> we got it on the first try. Not this. One with the key, but you lost the key. Oh, no. Man, Jenna's stupid. I mean, I don't know where this... I've clicked a muffin like seven times. Um, 
the Discord. So tap exclamation point Discord, and it should give you instructions on how to get there. Um, because there's not a link to it. You have to be a subscriber, and then it'll show up on like your Discord account that you can access it. Essentially. Does that work? Yeah, exclamation point Discord. Y'all, there's the muffin. How can there... There can't be three levels of difficulty to this game. I guess they're all the same amount of easy. Because you can't really have difficulty levels in a matching game. Jalapeno Cheetos Mac and Cheese. Well, kids should just get to play with whatever they want. There's some country that was, that I don't remember, uh, that had like, you have to have both boys and girls playing with all toys in ads. Or something like that. And I was like, yeah. Good, because everyone can play with anything. You're not only allowed to have one to have one thing you can imagine if you're a boy or a girl. I locked it. I locked it no matter how. You couldn't open it? Yeah, there are some like, um... I guess I would, you would call that an advertising law. I swear I've clicked a lot of these several times. Okay, that orange is up here somewhere. My parents love to tell people that my first... The first toy I loved, and I would take it everywhere, I was like two, was just that I would just carry around a naked Barbie with me everywhere. They don't, the, the, taking the Barbie around is not the, the weird part. The weird part is I just took a naked Barbie with me everywhere. And they let me. And they let me. It's beautiful. <laughs> what kind of word is that? That's fucking ugly as shit, Nancy. I loved Polly Pocket. Do you remember Polly Pocket and then... Was it Mighty Mighty Max? Or it wasn't Mad Max. Was it Mad Max? And it was the spooky ones. I loved those things. <laughs> That's what made me gay. Was the toys that I played with. Yeah, of course. Obviously. That's sarcasm. It says what? Elif? One bum, Trin, and Elif. Am I supposed to make a word with this? That was not Hi, a pretty Nancy. necklace. How's it going? It's been fun talking to you. Ain't that the truth? One bummalif trin. Trin Mumber. What the fuck could this mean? I'm going to go look at my checklist. When in doubt, get on Katie's ugly boat that she lives in. Ugh. You live like this? <laughs> it's a perfectly lovely boat. Okay. What's up? See you in a bit. Be careful out there. Oh, I remember Betty Spaghetti commercials, but I didn't have one. But they were cool. <laughs> you know how she looks like she lives on a boat? Oh, I wanted an Easy Bake Oven, but I never had one. What the deal with the broken? Oh, you don't check. It checks things off for you. Oh, and in reality, can't check that off yet because I actually can't. Because it won't let me. Investigate the burglary. How did the burglars get in? Burglar get in. The signal lamp. Replace the bulb in the signal lamp. Figure out 
What's the deal with the broken up picture of Caddy on the wall in the end of the tunnel? Oh yeah, Caddy's the name of their, their Loch Ness monster. So I still need to figure out what the words mean that Hilda put on the gift. Didn't I figure this out? Figure out what the letters mean on the piece of pa paper. I figured that out, didn't I? I thought I did. But that's just so me. Get him out of my hair. Dear Nancy, your dad has been home for an hour and a half. Is this for my mom? Oh, who's Hannah? Who's Hannah? Yeah, Daddy Drew. Oh, the maid. Okay, Rich. Whoa. Okay, so I'm going to go back to the Hot Kettle Cafe. Not the spider. I still doesn't know who Hannah is. Y'all think I pay some kind of attention in this? To the in the game? I thought maybe it was her stepmom. So find out how the burglars got in the house. If I were a burglar, burglar, how would I have gotten in to the hot kettle cafe? Oh! He's back. You again? See you around. Vote for Hope. Spread the word. All right. How could a burglar get in a small town like this? That's strange. Can I not pick up the salt? What are we... What's so strange about the salt? And I know about these, but I don't know what to do with them. And I keep getting turned around here. I, I, there's a third booth, isn't there? We don't know. No, I guess there's just two. I hate it when I go in a place and the table is pushed that far up against the wall and then I'm hitting the chair every time I'm trying to get up to shit. Nothing behind this one. Nothing behind this one. Isn't that weird? That seems like it would be weird. Wait, these box were those boxes there? Okay, there's got to be something I missed. Where she's she wants to know how the burglars got in. Oh, she cleaned up already. She cleaned up the crime scene already. Well, w now we'll never know. She cleaned up the crime scene. Illegal! <laughs> hey, I have a question. I, I need a hint. I don't understand where the burglars could have come from. Okay, what's the purpose of these things? Sandcastle, letters in the shell box. He'll pull back the top and uh, go back to the kayak. Did that. I got Hilda's gifts. Talk to Katie. I did talk to Katie, didn't I? When I went to go look at my computer, I'm close to finding that there's something hidden on the beach at the lighthouse that I missed. What's an anagram? Use your laptop to do the anagram. Okay, okay, okay. This has sent me on several trails. I like it. Thank you. Oh, ah! I like it. Do the wall things. You need to make a ro Oh. Not is there about 20 minutes left. Oh, got y'all. I never said dear chat. Mods, ban them. Just kidding. M mods, do it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, but that was What's fun, up? wasn't it? 
<laughs> Thank y'all for the hints. Enjoy. <laughs> Get them, gals. I love being messy and I live for drama. I'm messy and I live for drama. I'm going to use my anagram buster to figure out what those strange words on Hilda's gifts mean. I'm going to become a prank YouTuber. I'm not typing that. Elephants manual. Oh, mama. Auto busted. Help none be meteor. I don't think so. I don't think so. No humble preteen. So. <laughs> Not. That doesn't make sense. Let pin number ho. He Not. peel number tender. Helmet been prone. I Prom so. nut be Helene. <laughs> Can't be that. Not. Oh. Telephone number. <laughs> Maybe that's it. And what do I care about that? Telephone. Telephone number? Oh. Do I need to... No, 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 no. I need to Morse code her telephone number to her? Oh, my telephone number? I need to... Not this. <laughs> Not all this. GG and Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Uh, Brit Steps, thank you again. Salsa Senorita, good to see you. Thank you for the gift sub. I appreciate that. I have to rearrange the letters to say. Th oh, so I have to actually Maybe do it I myself. Maybe I can use my handy dandy anagram buster to figure out what those strange words on Hilda's gifts mean. Uh, oh, it's also Senorita. Thank you for the ten months as well. I appreciate that so much. Thank you, thank you. Oh. N E telephone num n number. Interesting. Interesting. Head for a lot half and send telephone number to Hilda in Morse code. Figure out what studio when I got a picture. Replace the bulb. Find something to get the... I gotta get the shutters open. How did the burglars get in? Check out the hot kettle. Okay. Okay, I need a... Um, Y'all, I hate poker. I have to tell you this. Fucking hate it. So I'm gonna need help. I, and I know that what's-his-name has... Yeah, I know that old has a book on poker... But I, d I hate poker. <laughs> so I'm going to just have y'all like help me make a royal flush for all of these things too. So that's, that's good. Y'all can do that. Oh yeah, I missed something at the lighthouse speech. Okay, well we'll go to that too. <laughs> I didn't say dear chat yet. Kamas, <laughs> thank you again for the bits. I appreciate that. And Rage, thank you for the bits. Not a royal flush is when the queen goes poop. You didn't hear about the queen? Is it something over here? Did they drop something over here? Kick at Moss, thank you for the bits again. I appreciate that. I'm missing something. Is it okay, dear chat? Is it by the beach? What am I missing? 
It that just doesn't sound like me. The lower part. I've missed something at the lower part of the beach. I thought I touched all the turds down here. S S. Maybe this broke off from a ship. Are you telling me I've never been over here before? Oh. Interesting. I assume I would ask Holt about that. He's a fisherman. But I guess every everyone has a boat. Why do so many people have boats who live by the water? <laughs> so many people have boats who live by the water. You again? Oh. See you around. Watch out for Caddy. Hi, Nancy. How's it going? It's been fun talking to you. Does she Later, have a Gator. boat? He has a boat. Who are y'all thirsting Hi, over Nancy. now? Someone broke into the hot kettle today. No kidding. Wow, that's the third one this week. Apparently all they took was food and boat parts. Sounds a lot like those two other burglaries. Imagine not having a boat. <laughs> Sad. Thanks for your time. My pleasure. So I really have to ask Katie about this? some public transportation in this community. Potatoes sound good. Oh, what am I going to have for dinner? I'm on my own tonight. What's up? I found this piece of wood on the beach. There's something strange about it. What do you mean? Let's see it. Ouch, those splinters are sharp. That is odd. <laughs> she, it looks like it's she, been in the water a long time. But if that she were gets, the case, those edges would be dull. That looks like it broke off of something just recently. She picks up the unsanded wood and just starts rubbing her hands all over. Ouch! The splinter's hurting me. That looks like it broke off recently. Does anything about it look familiar to you? No, not to me. But it might to someone else I know. Casey Porterfield. He works at the Maritime Library in Port Townsend. You should give him a call. His number is 360-555-3095. He loves checking out stuff like this. See you in a bit. I'll be right here. Girl, I know you will be. You ain't got... N she got nothing going on. Have I been up here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it would be rude to use my phone now. Katie, I know you got nothing going on. You don't even tell me. Surely that put... Okay, thank God. Maritime Library, this is Casey. Hi, my name is Nancy Drew. Katie Firestone suggested I give you a call. Katie who? Katie Firestone? Never heard of her. Oh. I know a marine biologist named Katie Firestone. Yes, that's her. <laughs> I'm staying with her here in what Snake What the Harbor. fuck? Oh, well, then what can I do for you? She said you might be able to help me she with said this you might be able wood. To help me identify the ship we need to talk louder, I think. I on the beach came from. How do you know it came from a ship? Because it says SS on it. The rest of the name is missing. Doesn't mean anything. Now, if it said SS, which stands oh my for God. Ship, that'd be different. Uh, actually, that is what it says. Oh, well, then it came from a ship. Or that means say, steamship? What kind of wood is it? It has to be a steamship for it to say SS on? <gasps> I see so many boats with SS on it, and they are not steamships. I've been lied to <laughs> several times. 
plywood? You're about as much use as a beanie in a hurricane. Look, if you want me to tell you what shipwreck that wood came from, you're gonna have to tell me what kind of wood it is. But I have no idea. Well, you just get yourself a book on wood and figure it out. Maybe Katie has one. Soon as you do, call me back. I love checking out stuff like this. Uzi V, thank you so much for the bits. Rage, thank you for the bits too. Still fixing the damn boat. <laughs> Rage, thank you so much again. I don't think she knows how to fix the boat. What's up? See you in a bit. I'll be right here. All right. I remember books existing in several locations. Can I read any of these books? Arboreal Morphology. Complex morphological issues, microscopic tracheid analysis. Oh shit. Home surfacing. This is what the magnifying glass is going to be for. Me, okay, hair model. You a call. She can help me out. Did they get a is this a stock photo from like a that they use for like hair model? Work. Oh my god, hell yeah. Doctor in Botany from University of Wisconsin Stout. Pop off, Dr. Pr Predoviku. All right, I'll give her a call, I guess. Big sleigh. This is Dr. Predoviku. Hi, my name is Nancy Drew, and I'd like some help identifying this piece of wood I found. I'd be happy to assist. Do you have our In mail Legend address? of the Crystal well, Skull. That's oh, that's funny. I don't have time to send it to you. Would it be possible to identify it over the phone? Certainly. Just hold it up to the phone for a couple of <laughs> seconds, and I'll take a reading. I'm kidding, of course. Wait, wait a second. I usually second. don't do this over the phone, but I'll give it a try. You will, however, need to take a look at your sample under a microscope. Oops, I better go do that. I'll call you right back. Under a microscope. If I were a microscope, I'd be right here. One slice of wood. Now look at it. One glass oh. slide. There. This is going to look so cool under the microscope. That was easy. Let's have a look. Oh, that's pine. All right, place your bets. I think it's pine because there's a lot of pine trees. Irina Predovicu speaking. Hi, this is Nancy Drew again. I've got the sample all ready. All right, we'll get started. Where did you find this wood? It's oh, that's pine. <laughs> probably used for a crate. Is the wood sample black, brown, or yellow? It's like brownish. Brownish. Brown, brown, or brown, reddish? It's like reddish. Brown, reddish. Brown. Does the sample have many holes, just a couple, or none at all? Were those holes? Let me check. Are these holes? How many holes? Just one. I'm the hole. <laughs> Those Does are the holes. Does the sample have many holes, just a couple, or none at all? Many. And are there some holes that are big and some that are small, or are they all the same size? There's just one hole here. <laughs> Are they all the same size? Oh, let me look again. Sorry, I just wanted to use the let music. We have that on the soundboard. I just wanted to use it. <laughs> They're all the same size. And are there some holes that are big and some that are small? Or are they all the same size? <laughs> They're all the same size. <laughs> okay. I just and have to remind y'all I'm gay every once time, in a while. Right? Y'all forget that I'm gay and I have to let them know. Are the holes really tiny? I mean, they're microscopic. Let me check. They're microscopic, okay. aren't they? And the holes are <laughs> You're really, really gay? Tiny, right? Yes. 
Well, unfortunately, I can't ID the sample because that description accounts for a lot of different woods. Beech, sycamore, alder, maple, you name it. Please check your sample again. Goodbye. So I did it wrong. So I'm going to call again and annoy her some more. Wood Labs, Irina speaking. Hi, this is Nancy Drew again. Do you think you could take another stab at identifying that wood sample for me? I'm sorry, but my policy is to limit free wood sample identification <laughs> to one per person. Could you please make an exception in my case? It's kind of an emergency. I'll tell you what. I'm doing a study on the side that focuses on problem solving. I'm collecting data by having people solve the puzzle that's on my website. Oh, if no. And when you solve it, I'll give you another free wood ID. Go to www.preduvichu.lab slash consult dot htm. Good luck. Not htm. Not even html. Are you kidding me? Is this a joke? How do I use the internet? <laughs> Is she kidding? Is she for real? Oh, here it is. <sighs> Salsa Senorita, thank you again. Thank you for the bids. It Carly, thank you for the bids. <laughs> More holes. Kick at mods, thank you so much with the bids. So if you mess up one question. So you mess up one question and then you get okay. <gasps> I'm not doing it. It's a slide puzzle. I am not doing this. We have a policy. I have a very strict policy. I'm not doing the slide puzzle. Wood sample microscope. Wow, they did this at the beginning. And they're not, they're horizontal. The wood is... Oh, they don't tell you because they want you to get all the questions right the first time. <laughs> You can help solve it. Pacific. Run, Stan. I'm gonna, let me save it. It doesn't... T oh, hold on. You want me to slide up? Okay, I did up. All right, Pacific Run, Stan is doing the puzzle. Right. Yo, I want y'all to sit down. I want you to shut up. And I want y'all to learn something. Just so y'all know what's about to happen. And then I bet this one goes left. We don't do slide puzzles. I did it. You got me there. Thank you so much, Pacific Sun. I appreciate that. Wait, what happened? Did I do it? Do I just need to call her now? You I did it. reached the desk of Dr. Irina Predovicu. I'm away from my desk, but we'll be back in a couple of minutes. Thank you. In a couple of minutes? I don't have a couple of minutes. In a couple of minutes? Imagine using your voicemail for a couple of minutes. Okay. Oh, have to take a call from the microscope You have view. reached the desk of Dr. Irina Predovicu. I'm away from my desk, but we'll be back in a couple of minutes. Thank you. Y'all, they, they did this microscope part at like the beginning of the game. Isn't that wild? And I'm just doing it now. Y'all, on, on Game Boomers, they did this at the beginning.
Case jumps. Thank Pleasure you for the back. gifts. Hi, uh, oh, I appreciate you. that. Could you try to identify that wood sample for me again? Is the wood thank sample you, black, thank you. brown, or yellow? Okay, I'm looking up the answers. Call her, tell her it's brown. Brownish. Brown brown or brown reddish? Brown reddish. Does the sample have many holes, just a couple, or none at all? Rage, thank you so much for the bits again. I appreciate that. Many holes, same size, and pretty size. So I got the last question wrong. Many. And are there some holes that are big and some that are small, or are they all the same size? They're all the same size. Okay. And the holes are really, really tiny, right? No, they're pretty sizable. Then you've got a tropical hardwood. I was assuming the sample was a North American wood. All right. I'm pissed for one reason. Here's a reason. On the sample? Oh, wait. When you're looking at something under the microscope, you can't say, is it big or small? Because everything under a microscope is small if you're looking at it under a microscope. Big and small are relative terms. And you need to ask me, is it big compared to this or to that? You can't. She bamboozled me. She's not using scientific words. I know everything. <laughs> yes, there are horizontal lines. If this wood is used for creating, then it's probably Luan. It's fairly common in plywood, but it's pine. a rainforest timber. So it's, it's the same amount of letters as pine wood. P-I-N-E-L-U-A-N. -E so. Luan, all right. Thanks for your help. Glad to have been of service. Wah, 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 wah. Okay, Stubbs, thank you for the gift sub again. Rachel, thank you for the bits. And Brit Stubbs, thank you for the bits too. Mama. Oh, wah, 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 wah. Who, now, who did I need to tell about that? Katie? What's up? Oh. See you in a bit. Enjoy. Oh, I needed to call the other guy. Okay, I'm going to go back in the cabin. Maritime Library, this is Casey. Hi, this is Nancy Drew. I called before about the driftwood. Never heard of you. Now, if you'd have said Nancy Drew... Yes, that's me, Nancy Drew, Katie Firestone's friend. I need to so send him my sandwich. About here, Nancy? I'm gonna send, I'm gonna mail him my sandwich. Luan. Well, if that driftwood did come from a cargo container that's part of a shipwreck, there's a good chance I can figure out which one. Call me back in an hour or so. You can identify a ship by what its cargo containers are made out of? Ever since the hobo spider got into the U.S. by laying eggs in the wood crating of ships coming from Europe, the feds have made sure that cargo ships keep real careful records. Of course, I'll be taking things like tides, currents, weather conditions, proximity to Snake Horse Harbor. I'll be taking all those factors into consideration, too. I really appreciate your doing this for me, Casey. And well, you should. I love how she doesn't tell anyone she's rich because she just expects them to do everything for free. And if they knew she was rich, they'd ask her for money. Okay, let's go do the things at the place. Look at what closet again? The closet in here? <laughs> it was pine wood. She really cleaned this place up. She really Marie kondo this place. Katie needs to come break in here and steal the boat parts. Back at the boat? Wait, why would I look at the closet at the boat? I... No. Nothing behind this one. Why would I go into the closet on the boat? Is it because she has ugly clothes? Because I already know about that. Oh, it was Pan?
That's then it. <laughs> what are y'all talking about today? Oh, I hate this. Okay. Right of door, left window, power. Got it. Okay. Don't worry about it. I don't do these kinds of puzzles. Card games, I don't play. If you wanna, if you wanna play chess, pull up a table, pull uh, a chair, <laughs> pull up a chair, cause I'll play chess with you. Oh, that one was right. No, no Uno. Why would I play Uno? I made a royal flush. No. Why would I play Uno? <laughs> Not pull up a table. Uh, le left, right of door, left of long window. Oh, this, this one didn't. Shh, shh, Nancy, shh. Well, Scopa's not played with a typical deck of cards. Thank you so much for the bits, uh, GG. That's not a typical deck of cards. That's a Scopa deck. And it's, it's Italian. It's Italian. It's Italian. It's Italian. Oh, this is supposed to be I queen. Made a royal flush. She sounds like she like is proud of herself for like taking making a turd or something. I really am sorry. I'm not here for these long. I don't. I. I hate poker. I skipped it a lot in Desperate Housewives, or just clicked all the buttons. I made a royal flush. <laughs> I made a poopy. Yes, you did. So one of these booths has it. Here we go. A royal flush is just ten jack, queen, king, and ace in one suit. Suit. Sweet. Suit. Well... Well, that's nice. <laughs> well, that's nice. Good for poker. I don't know. Poker's one of those games. Literally every... Do y'all... Y'all, do y'all have friends who are always like, yeah, let's play poker. And you're like, I'd rather be bored. No, I'd rather be bored. I'd rather us not do that. Everyone has that poker friend. What was that? What was that? That sounded like a cat. Hi, Nancy. How's it going? Did y'all not? Did they not it's hear that? It's been fun talking to you. Later, Gator. Scopas. Well, Scopas for intellectuals. <laughs> Mama, Scopas for intellectuals. Did that sound not come from in here? I bet that's how those burglars got in here. Not this. I can't see a thing. I'm gonna need a flashlight. Y'all, the Irish music really stepped up when I opened that up. That's exciting. Hi, Nancy. How's it going? Do you have a flashlight I could borrow? Sorry. Oh. It's been fun talking <laughs> to you. Later, Gator. She just really you said again? no. Would you happen to have a flashlight I could borrow? Nope. See you around. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I like his attitude. Uh, well, 
I bet Katie has a fla- has a flashlight. I don't want to ask Andy Jones. Andy, what's his name? These people all have boats, but they don't have flashlights. Hey, what's going on? It sounds like you fixed the boat! Sounds like you're making progress. I'm getting there. I remembered that a friend of mine had stashed some boat parts in my storage locker. Would you you just now remembered? Flashlight? I have a headlamp. I mean, I have one somewhere. I'm sorry, Nancy. I'm so hungry I can hardly see straight, let alone think straight. I made this sandwich for you, Katie. Hi, Katie. I made a sandwich for you. Would you like a sandwich? That would be awesome. Here's a sandwich for you. Great. Here you go. Mmm, I'm starving. <laughs> I don't feel so good all of a sudden. What did you put in that thing? Oh, man. Baking powder. <laughs> you gave Katie food poisoning? No, I mean, not exactly. Uh, Something in the sandwich I made for her didn't agree What was wrong with the sandwich, Katie? Outside, leaning over the rail and, you know. Gee, Nan, I've never given any of your friends food poisoning. I'm sure it was just an honest mistake. Give it another try, Nancy. Just go easy on the salmonella this time. Very funny. I put baking soda in it. And bleach. <laughs> Just a little baking soda and some bleach. What does she want? Just a fucking bacon, lettuce, and tomato? What's that? Oh, okay. Is she allergic to something? Or is she just... What's up? Here's, Here's a, a sandwich for you. Here's a sandwich Here for you. Mm, I'm starving. You want a that sandwich? Thank you. Okay, you wanted my headlamp. Where's my headlamp? You oh want a gosh. sandwich, it was Katie? Like in the engine compartment the whole time. You dumbass, See Katie. See you in a bit. Have fun. Hey, Katie. You want a sandwich? She stopped moving. Oh no, her hands are moving. Did you want a sandwich, Katie? I need to call back the wood guy. <laughs> but what is that? But dawn, it's Christmas. This is Nancy Drew. Any luck finding what shipwreck that piece of driftwood came from? Sorry, can't talk now. I'm waiting for a real important call from Nancy Drew. Casey, that's me. I'm Nancy Drew. Oh. And Look in the closet. News. You know what? the name of the shipwreck? The SS Whitechapel Dawn sank five years ago right there in the channel outside Snake Horse Harbor, about a mile and a half due northwest of the lighthouse. Really? I hear that channel up there's been pretty busy, what with that orphaned whale messing things up for the fishermen and all. Anyway, everything fits except one thing. Uh-oh. It was pine wood. went oh. down in deep water. Real deep water. Too deep for currents to be carrying debris up from it. Just not possible. What about volcanic activity? Maybe it sank on top of an undersea vent or something. I've been doing this type of research for 20 years, young lady. When I say something's not possible, it's not possible. Yet somehow a piece of wood from it washed ashore. What kind of ship was the Whitechapel Don? It was just a regular old freighter bound for San Francisco from Vancouver, British Columbia. Nothing unusual. Vancouver. What rumors? How about the smuggling? The smuggling? Please tell me everything. Nothing to tell. After it sank, some crew members said there was something unusual about the cargo it had been carrying. That's all. No specifics, just rumors. How many people went down with the ship? Zero. Everybody managed to survive. Official cause was foul weather. But whenever a boat goes down in those parts, they always unofficially blame it on... Oh, what do they call that sea serpent up there? Caddy? No, thanks. Caddy! That's what they call it! Caddy! Anyway, this has been fun, young lady, but I need to get back to work. Uh, by the way, I just got done emailing you something. What? I said, I just got done emailing you something. Great, thanks. Well, goodbye, Casey. Goodbye, Caddy. I certainly hope he doesn't operate heavy machinery. Mama, if I wanted an old man to 
To hear an old man yelling, I'd watch C-SPAN. Hello! Uh. <laughs> all right. Where's all this water coming from? <laughs> We're having weather. <laughs> what is that smell? She's someone pooped in the, <laughs> in the fish <laughs> freezer again. Is this the closet y'all wanted me to check? Should I eat those fish? How did he get my email? I'm kind of a stained glass art freak and came across it. That's what y'all wanted me to see? Make him into a sandwich for Kate. <laughs> right through her. I'm kind of stained glass. I thought you might find this interesting since you're into stack out bombback.lab slash example slash royal. Let me tap that into my Google. The hot kettle was originally called the Royal Flush Saloon. Interesting. Oh, I wasn't supposed to know how to do that. <laughs> So now I'm supposed to know about the royal flush. Oh, okay. I thought you were just supposed to know. I thought I missed something else. Well, that's good. To, that was great to know. Ha 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 ha. Smuggling, cigarettes and liquor. Drugs, firearms. Smuggling is certain to exist. Exotic and endangered animals, pelts of protected animals, even plants. My plants? I smuggled them to the afterlife. Hello! Uh. Uh, just a summary on smuggling. Thank you, Kit Moss, for the bids. Echolocation, thank you for the bids. Not the traffic. Did you come by boat? You arrived by boat? How did she push that? Does she just push it? Helen, I'm going in your basement. Hmm, a cairn. Wonder who made it. I only know what cairns are because of Tomb Raider. Jesus Christ, this is spooky. This must be where people smuggled stuff through, right? Here is the last thing I need right now. Wait, no, you can still exit the tunnel. Camping gear is the last thing <sighs> I need right now. Yes, I love Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider is one of my favorite franchises, except for the last three games. There's an Easter egg down here. Oh, thank you, Kit Kat Moss. Why aren't we going out of here? Camping gear is the last thing I need right now. She just finds a secret tunnel and it leads somewhere and then we just don't go? Are you kidding me? What? Oh, what's that? We don't know. It won't let me look at the box. All I can look at is this Kieran. She doesn't want to appear in a random camping store? Well, I have news for her. You better. <laughs> they need to know they have a hole in their floor. Oh my god, it's a maze. Oh shit. 
I thought there was one way in, one way out, Mama. I've got enough ten penny nails. Thank you very much. So this just goes to like everyone's fucking place? This is how murderers move around the town. Oh, there's another Kern. Another Kern? <laughs> this is that way, okay. Another Kern? What was that? Elvis was here. I knew it. I knew it. Another Cairn. Another Cairn. Glad I'm wearing comfortable shoes. Uh oh. Looks like I'm gonna be doing a lot of walking. When does she die? How much walking? Whew! I feel like I've walked for miles. Another Karen. Karen just sounds like like saying Karen, but with a what kind of accent would that be? That's an anvil. I know that. Is that an anvil? <laughs> Is that an Easter egg? What's Easter? Some oil. I needed that. That's for the rusty thing. Dead. That sound. Where have I heard that sound before? It takes two but you to make it disappear. Oh, it takes but two to make it disappear. There's obviously more to this, like the other half of the picture. Oh, yeah, this is the other side of that door. This is the other side of the sad door. So, I did I... I guess I put those in the right order, huh? I guess I put those in the right order. Did I accidentally solve it? Mama, I see a puzzle. I start clicking. All right, I guess we'll mo walk for miles again. This is, uh, this is, uh, uh, well, who was the witch in the woods? The Blair, the Blair Saint Witch. The Blair Witch, the Blair. Blair Saint Clair. There was a tunnel this way too. Where does this Another one go? Cairn. Oh, this is just a mega cairn. I do declare. Blessing cairn. That's the way out. Got it. Oh. Mm, how... <laughs> I come out and I go, do you want fries with that? I don't know. Hi, Nancy. How's it going? Did you know that there's a trap door in the floor of your banquet room? A trap door? No. Where does it go? Opening and closing the hardware store if you want it. Oh, interesting. Maybe. Is it? I don't want any. The only Easter egg I want is if Shorty maybe pops out of the hole. Thank you, Kit Kat Moss. Thank you again, Rach, for the bits. May Morgan, good to see you. Thank you for the bits. She said no camping gear. We're not doing it. It drops down into a tunnel, and when I explored it, I found trap doors going up into two other shops. A tunnel? I don't know anything about it. It's probably how those burglars got in and out. Look, tunnels are dangerous. I don't want you going down there anymore. You don't mean that. I mean it. Just forget about this whole thing. A crime was committed, and I just discovered something that might help solve it. I can't just drop it. Okay, look. I guess if you're real careful, you can keep poking around down there. 
But I don't want you telling anybody else about that tunnel without coming to me first. I got my reasons. I've also got work to do. I'm gonna tell you everybody. Again? Oh, see you around. Yeah, whatever. Except Jim. <laughs> okay. You'll never guess what happened, but I found the tunnel. <laughs> and now I'm gonna go to the lighthouse. <gasps> I have the hiccups. I feel like she knew about the tunnel and she's been hiding stuff down there. But I also think that she's, she wouldn't have broken to her own place. I still don't think it's her. It's one of the guys. It's, it's Andy or the sailor. Oh. Oh, I have to go flip the switch. Got it. <gasps> Are you kidding me? Three, four, seven, five. <gasps> if he had changed the code, I'd be so mad. Are you kidding me? Brit Seps, thank you for the bits again. All the fi the fishes? Who's Katie? <laughs> Not this. Okay, so this. So now I have a... Oh! There's a hole in the hole? What was that? There's puzzles. I'm in the sea caves. <laughs> I'm in the sea caves. <laughs> okay, Nancy. Oh! Oh, so the boat went here. Yay! Good for you, Nancy. So what are... These are some sort of symbols. I don't know what they are. Oh, this one turns. Do these have like some sort of corresponding thing with them? It, that one. These are the inverse. Aren't these? These are inverted. Oh, so that is the, that's the inverse of that. Well, yeah, they're inverted. Uh oh. So should I just get them all to what they are supposed to be in verse? Yeah. Does it stay? It doesn't stay on it. So what's the point? I don't, I can't solve this yet. Oh, okay. Well, maybe y'all couldn't solve it yet, but. Uh oh. <laughs> Where am I? Oh, okay. Maybe y'all might have a problem solving it yet, but y'all know me. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa. I need a light bulb. Now, can y'all just tell me which, I don't want to have to go up and down here 20 fucking times. Which light bulb is it? <sighs> sea serpent, take the third from the right, working light, third from the right, second to last. That's not what this says. The one that doesn't ting. Shake it? How would I shake it? There are a couple that would work. Take the third from right. The light... They'll make a ping sound when... The only ping sound I can fucking hear is this fucking thing outside. It's annoying. 
Can we cut that cord? Would love if we could stop this thing. Oh, it says ping in the, their subtitles. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, well, I'm just yelling about nothing then. Y'all know me. That's just so me. That is so me, though. Okay, this is a shutter. Perfect. Did it open? Does it need more? I don't know what that thing is. Now, about this light bulb. Why do I have a light? Do I need to replace the... It looks bright to me. Oh, do I put the light bulb in here? Oh, got it. Okay. I should do dots and dashes for the whole thing. So I'm typing the word telephone number. I'm typing out telephone number. Is there a book on Morris? Five. Oh, uh oh. Oh, I did the first one right. Ask if we can get McDonald's. <laughs> I did the first one right. Morris, there's Morris code on her laptop. Oh, oh I'm not doing that. Two. I'm not doing that. Three. I'm having to lean in and then five, five, five. 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 five four. Uh oh. Ah, ah! What happened? Oh. Four. Uh oh. Three. Uh oh. Nine. Nine. Is that really doing it? This puzzle took you a million years as a four twenty sixty nine. Oh my God, that did, not this. What was that? Did she send me a message back? And it won't let me eat the Coco Kringle bar? Not three, two, three! Not do over. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll yell Hello? at her. Hello, oh. Nancy. Hilda here. Hilda? Hilda Swenson? Easy, girl. It's not like you're talking to the Queen of England or anything. <gasps> She's got a transatlantic accent! Stuffy lot, those Windsor. Stuffy lot, those Windsor. Oh! Okay, Rich, she knows the royal family. <gasps> She's a royal sympathizer. <laughs> Stuffy lot, those Windsors. It's just like I kind of feel like I know you. It's just that I kind of feel like I know you. More important, I know you. Or rather, I know I can trust you. Just in time, too. I have the feeling things around there are about to get out of hand. I have a funny feeling things are about to get out of hand. Hand. What do you mean? What do you mean? What kind of thing? She's shaking her shoulders and her hips. As in all good films, all will eventually be revealed. In the meantime, I've sent you an email. Read it, follow the instructions, and we'll do lunch. How 
Do people keep getting my email? That'd be great. No, no, no. It's just an expression, dear. No one in Hollywood ever really has lunch when they say they're going to do lunch. Oh. I'll be in touch. And rest assured, I'll be watching. Which reminds me. It's the bee's niche. I couldn't see who. I hope they aren't doing any damage. They did leave kind of a mess. We really must put a stop to this, Nancy. Ciao. Did I tell her my name even? Welcome, Mila. B bye, Rach. I'm glad you got to be here. Thank you for the bits. Afterthought. Thank you for the three months. And Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits again. Apparently, it's a public email address. Apparently, I have a very public email. Where am I going? Oh, my email. <laughs> Get a smartphone. The danger is that, yeah, well, they're all stealing my, they're going to steal my identity. Oh my gosh, Sammy Main with the 13 freaking months. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. What's up? See you in a bit. Keep Have those skus 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 going. Bad news. Dear Nancy, after your father took one of the longest showers in history. Oh, this isn't <laughs> this isn't from Hilda. I don't care about Hannah. Oh, something from Hilda. Nancy! I just left something for you with the coordinates below. As you can see. Oh, I, I went from transatlantic to like a little bit of Brooklyn. We won't read it out loud. Maybe we won't read it out loud. So North 48, 42A, B, C. Is that a coordinate? West one two three zero eight point seven D E. To figure out what numbers the letters represent, take a good look at these. Oh my God! What the fuck? You should look at the box near Katie. Oh. Um. Okay. Near the nuns, the ID number of the buoy. Oh, not this. Smart, resourceful. I've lost the accent. Darling, got it back. Okay, so I'm going to screenshot that. Darling, hey, do y'all think there's like 20 minutes left? <laughs> Snap out of it. <laughs> Me, my brain just absolutely broken. My brain fucking broken, just going through all the awful accents I do. This box? Oh, she shops at the same place. What's up? Oh, this? See you in a bit. Have fun. Is this supposed to make me think that maybe she did it? Save King. Oh. I mean, there's got to be one store at this place, right? Did she steal the fucking parts? Okay. Katie's a thief. What's up? Jenna Deblin said some of the things that were stolen from her back room in that burglary were boat parts she'd bought at Save King. And... I noticed a box from Save King over there and just thought it was kind of an interesting coincidence. Everyone around here shops at Save King for boat parts and practically everything else. Any other questions? Are you aware that there's a whole lot of fish going bad in your freezer? Of course I am. Whoever tore up my engine damaged my wiring too. Refrigerators out, freezers out, TVs out. It's herring if I'm not mistaken. 
The same kind of fish orcas in captivity are fed. All right. I've been feeding the orca okay, but I'm not the only one. I can't afford to feed her much, and there's not enough natural fish in the channel for her to exist on, yet she's doing for fine. For her to exist which means on? someone else is feeding her too. Live now, on. This is not a good time for me to be trying to entertain a house guest. How about a rain check? Did she kick me up? No problem. I understand. As soon as I get this fixed, I'll take you to the mainland so you can catch a flight back to River Heights. I'm sorry, Nancy. I didn't want to live on your shithole boat anyway. She kicks me off of her shitty boat. Prison. All right, let me pull up the thing. So I need to figure out the number of nuns surrounding Snake Horse Har- Oh, this isn't Snake Horse Harbor. This is the cafe. <laughs> What's an isophase buoy? How many dollars Jenna charges for a cup of clam tr Oh, I do need to know that. Clam chowder, $3 a cup. So A, B, C, D, E, A, B, C, D, E. For a cup of clam chowder, so D equals three. Oh, there's more letters in this? Number, I mean numbers. <laughs> what the fuck are nuns? How many nuns? There's a lot of sirens in DC today. Is something happening? All right, I need to get on the boat. Oat milk? Number of isophase buoys. You know what? Smuggler ship. Oh, no, I'm like at the on one of the last puzzles. Take the kayak out, find the four nuns. There are really nuns out here? Is this a... No, not a deer chat. This is just me wondering to myself. Which one was the number on the buoy? Let me look. The ID number of the buoy that's got graffiti. Oh, that one doesn't have graffiti on it. Number of the buoys plus four. It's number of... channel marker. Katie said not to go past them. Katie also kicked me out of her fucking house. So. She's a hater. Does this one have a graffiti on it? Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I died! That's hateful. They're really strict. Pass the buoy in the middle, Nancy crashes on the rocks. The diva did not serve today. Oh my god, is that the same one? Oh, I'm lost in the ocean! Oh my god, that's the same one. Oh, I'm turning. Oh. Oh, here's some. What's that? You know what? How many Karens were there? <laughs> there were five Karens. Got it. Back to the three cards for out. Okay, dear chat, what are nuns? Six, eight, there are four of them. Eight. 
Well, y'all are never going to believe this. <laughs> There's a list of nautical terms on Nancy's computer. Y'all are never gonna believe this, but I remembered. And I officially have all of the numbers. Where's my GPS? Oh, the blinking ones? <laughs> she dropped it? Wait, where is the GPS, though? I'm not joking. Nancy dropped the GPS when she... Are you kidding me? In my inventory? She really did? You saw it? Oh, it's... Oh, you mean you see it here. Oh! Thank y'all so much. Oh my god. Egg on my face. Blip. Okay. I am so sorry. Y'all know me. I keep scrolling back. I thought y'all were serious that it fell off of the boat. And I was about to be very mad. So, 48, 48, 42, 485. And longitudinally, I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, 0, 8, 7, 3, 5. I feel like I've probably been there a million times. Katie really turned against me. I'm not over it. I'm not over it. Gigi, thank you again for the bits. Kit Kat Moss, thank you again. I might be dying at four. That's why I'm getting through this. The Salsa Senorita, thank you again for the bits. Soul Skater with the... No, 20 months. Thank you so much. Get those skus, skus, skus. Fight the power, thank you for the bits. Super Junior Trash, thank you for the eight months. Not this. Gigi. Nuns with full habit look more. Not this. Not this, Gigi. Yeah, it's just right over here. I've probably been here a million times. Oh. I don't know. Maybe I haven't. Uh-oh. There's too many rocks. Oh! How did I get over here? <laughs> Which way am I facing? Uh-oh. Okay, okay, okay. It's a very specific spot. She has... She has a spot. Oh my god, that's a mine. That's a sea mine, mama. Zap I don't know when it tech. Opens yet. Hello? Hello, Nancy. I commend your ability to take direction and to follow through. You're definitely a cut above. And for that, you've just been rewarded. She's creepy. She just watches what me. What am I supposed to do with this thing? You're to take it with you. But for now, listen carefully. I hope you like poems. <clears throat> <sighs> Below ground is a rock with a strange anvil look. When you're near oh, it, I remember that. what's above. Letters found at the beach will put a new spot in reach. Letters only a sailor could love. Oh, my apologies, dear. I'm many things, but I'm afraid I'm not much of a poet. Y'all... This is what, when you are so rich.
And you think everyone gives a shit about you because you're rich and you were famous. You just really lose it and you have to create drama for yourself. Not that I'm complaining, but wouldn't it be easier if you just gave me whatever it is you want me to have? Or I could simply give it to you. You might just turn around and toss it away. But if I make you earn it, you'll feel like it's yours and use it properly. Now, where was I? Ah, the device you just found. It'll come in handy when you get where you're going after you've gone where my poem takes you. Goodbye, Nancy. Oh no, please don't hang up. I've got so many questions. I hate this woman. You know she didn't pay her taxes. <laughs> You know she cheated on her taxes. You know it. I know it. Is this the right way? Yeah. No, she's making... She's causing drama because she's rich and she has time to. I'm trying to find a burglar. She's in her, in her fantasy world where she gets to watch everyone and everyone's like a puppet in her show. Paid zero in taxes in 2022. Release the taxes, mama. She's rich and she's taking free gro- That part. She's rich and she's still having someone who owns their own small business and who is probably struggling make them buy her the groceries for her. Uh, agoraphobia doesn't mean you don't give people money for things. Agoraphobia is not fear of paying for goods and services. Okay? You could slip a 20 under your doormat. Okay? That's not fear of paying people what they earned. <laughs> That's not what that means. Now, what was I doing? Oh, I need to find a new waypoint, don't I? Below grounds rocks, when you look for letters found on a beach, letters only a sailor could love. <sighs> so I remember where the anvil stone is. Oh, I'm sorry. I went off. I shouldn't have gone off. Do I have to tell her Hi, every Nancy, time I how's it go? Going? Jenna, is there something you're not go in the tunnel? Me about that tunnel I found? My family has always denied that Shanghai ever took place in Snake Horse Harbor. Why? Because it did take place. And my great great grandfather, the man who built this place, he was a big part of it. I'd always Bye, been told that the tunnel he and his cohorts used to kidnap people had been filled in. And Aunt Iris said nothing to me about that trap door you found. If word gets out about that tunnel, the truth about my great-great-grandfather will come out eventually, too. I just wanted to spare my parents' feelings. She's trying to cover up, cover up her family's awful past. Oh, we can't really say any... <laughs> All we can say is, okay. It's been fun talking ha, 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 to you. Ain't ha, that ha, the truth? Ha ha. Gotta go. Ha ha. The transition from that to clam chowder. The whiplash I just got. Oh, our culprit predictions are it's either the... It's not her. She's just trying to run a business. Three minutes until Joe dies. Thank you for the bits, Cosmos. And Brit steps again. I appreciate that. I guess it's true. She doesn't ask for the groceries. You got me there. Oh, this is... This is the one y'all want me to... The last thing I need right now. Keep opening this one? Camping gear is the last thing I need right now. What was that? The whole building just shook. Camping gear is the last thing I need right now. 
Oh, the other one. <laughs> not this one I just wanted to test I was just trying something out I was testing y'all this one I've got enough ten penny nails thank you very much I've got enough ten penny nails thank you very much I've got enough ten penny nails thank you very much I've got enough ten penny nails, thank you very much. Wow. What was that? Oh, I love the dog! Does this just continue going until I stop? Not the FBI. That was me after 10 milligrams, uh, 25 milligrams Delta. Nancy took 25 milligrams Delta 8 THC. There's a gas leak in the tunnel. Wait, where was that? Oh, no, no, it wasn't that way. Oh, no, no! The building just shook again. When my Fitbit says I need 6,000 more steps. My Fitbit says I need 6,000 more. That was the right way? No, isn't the... It's on this side, isn't it? Is it at the other side? I thought the anvil was on this side. It's on this side. <laughs> it's okay, we can go back. Phlebotanist, thank you so much for the bits. <laughs> and relax, Nancy, thank you for the bits too. We're getting carbon monoxide poison in. We sure are. She's definitely getting her steps in. It was over here? Oh, it was right here, wasn't it? Uh oh. <laughs> There's a it goes to another tunnel. Oh, I didn't hear what she said. Oh no. The building just shook again. I think maybe they're doing road work. Either they're doing road work or the building's falling down. Oh my god. This is... This, this is... I'm the camera in a colonoscopy right now. Oh my god. Oh, no do I have... Signal. Oh, that sucks. Okay. Well, it is a good idea. Oh my god. I would be panicking so hard. Is there even... A... Oh, cool. I should have known. <laughs> Is there even um, oxygen under the ground? I don't think so. The music just got really cheerful again. No signal. Okay, I'll just screenshot that. Am I supposed to hit the button here? More coordinates. I should have known. More coordinates. No. I should have known. That looks like the drawing that of the button. Like the device I oh. found in the buoy. That looks like the device I found in the buoy. Oh, that plus that. Oh, I got it. Nope, I got it. It's fine. How do I get? Oh my God. How do I get out of here? 
Oh, I made it. This is time. This time there is legit 20 minutes left. I can deal with that. We got it under control now. Mama, we're busting out of here. We're going back. We're stealing the kayak one last time. If you breathe, if you panic, don't you breathe more? I remember the ps 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 note. Oh no. Okay, we're back on track. Chat, we're back on track. Oh. Oh no no. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Now I can use my GPS. I'm gonna input these coordinates. Fort oh no. Okay, make new. And it was North 48, 42, 522, 123, 08, 799. Wait, which one did it put on the map? This one? Uh-oh. I wasn't paying attention. I'm right here. Did it put this one? Oh, the middle one? No, this one was already here. It's this one. The more north middle one. Okay, got it. Does Katie die at the end? So, well, well, wait, the original mystery, wait, Katie kicked me off my, her boat. Why am I trying to solve her mystery anymore? I don't help people who kick me off of their whole houseboat. Everyone dies at the end. She kicked me off the boat. I don't know. I don't really know what direction I'm going. I think this is the right way. Oh, I'm here. Oh, use the button. <laughs> that mama. Binoculars. Hilda? Uh-oh, I'm getting predictable. This really will be our last conversation. Oh, I hope not. I'd really like to meet you. I'm afraid that's not going to happen. So, here you are in the home stretch. Oh, she wants me to reply. <laughs> this part. That I'm not going to do Hold her hostage, else, Mama. Tell me why this is so important to you. Okay, look. When I made my exit from Snake Horse Harbor, I left everything behind. You know, to kind of prove that I'd lost all my marbles. Problem is, I should have been more sympathetic about I Hilda. Now I should have taken with me my notebook on Benjamin Hawkins. Someone has obviously found it and is misusing it. See, my husband and I explored every inch of land in, around, and under Snake Horse Harbor. What we discovered, and we discovered everything, we wrote down in that notebook. So this fishy thing that's going on, you feel like it's your fault. Precisely. So, use what I just gave you and take a look at the boat in the bottle that Andy has. A really good look. When the time comes, you'll know what to do with what you see. I really liked the boat in the bottle. Okay, I take it all back. I like Hilda. She's fun. She loves a mystery. Nancy loves a mystery. But, um... Oh, and one more one thing. More thing. Why do you want everyone to <laughs> think you're crazy when you're obviously not? Oh, Nancy. After
after my husband died, I this part got though. Bored. I love the sad one. She got but bored. The Horse Harbor, I got tired of them. So I moved across the channel. And to make sure people left me alone. You pretended to be nuts. <laughs> But then I got to thinking that it might be a good idea to make contact with someone trustworthy, just in case. Hence the messages in the bottles. Now, get going before it's too late. And what I just told you, keep it to yourself, okay? So sure. she wanted people... So won't be calling me anymore? No. This, as they say... Okay, the I'm kind of on the fence right. about her. Well, I've enjoyed knowing you. And I you. Thank you, Nancy. Goodbye, Hilda. Okay, I understand wanting to be alone. That's chill. What I don't, she, you know, she didn't really need to create all this drama around herself. That part, it kind of seems like she went, she took, she took it a little too far. I don't think that part was necessary. She did it just for fun. Imagine just being rich and bored, and so you just get to have fun and create all of this little drama for other people to solve. <laughs> Live, lie, laugh. Yeah. I, I can't help but feel like... I don't know. Being bored, and so creating this drama... Wait, wait, what's the drama? Wait, how does this connect? Wait, what's the mystery? <laughs> Cosmos, thank you for the bits. And Bristeps, thank you again for the bits. So, the orca. But she couldn't have known about the about the orca. The murder? And who trashed Katie's boat is the main thing. And so this is, it's kind of like drama within drama with her, right? Shouldn't she be arrested if she knows? Wait, 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 what'd she tell me to do with the binoculars? Uh-oh, I'm, oh, I forgot to put on my helmet! <laughs> Andy's boat in a bottle. Thank you so much. Okay. I just got so confused trying to wrap my head around what exactly she knows and what's happening. Not your boat in a bottle, Andy. Well, it feels like there's there's a you know, I know the main mystery. Who messed up Katie's boat? And but there's this secondary mystery of like something's going on, something's happening. Yeah, I don't really understand what Hilda has to do with the main mystery, I guess. Hi, Nancy. Thanks for your time. Drop by again. She just kind of fell into this sub mystery. This secondary mystery, I guess. Yeah, Hilda. Don't get me wrong. I love that Hilda's part of this game. There are some kind of symbols on those sails. Just as I suspected. Snake monster. That is true. She was mayor, so she probably, like, watches over the town. Okay. That's, that's pretty fair, honestly. You love your town. You watch over it. So, those were the symbols on the snake monster. And I get there by going to the lighthouse and then go, oh, got it. The robberies and the, wha the whale. Wait, what's the mystery with the whale? That it exists? The people in this town didn't know that whales existed. And they even have, they have a museum, but it was like a, to them, it was like a dragon museum. They thought it was all mythical. And now the town is just now realizing. <laughs> it's the year of realizing things for this town. 
It's really the year of realizing things for this town. Hey, Shelby. I don't like that this resets every time. Three, four, seven, five. All right, how many of y'all's pin numbers is that? Don't answer. <laughs> they don't know why the... Well, why would the whale leave when the... Hello, the clam chowder in this town's amazing. Hello. Well, and Katie's feeding it. It's not, it's not, it's not, not that. <laughs> Hello. Oh, maybe that's what, whoa, wait, wait. Clam chowder. Do they have, oh, I know why I'm doing that accent because clam chowder on the East Coast. That's what that accent was the whole time. Duh. <laughs> yeah. Clam chowder. See? Ah, see, it, make, it made sense. Not airport clam chowder. Wait a second. I would never get on a plane and clam chowder on the plane. Wait. I only have half of these. There's, there's five and there were... Uh-oh. Yeah, dear chat, there are five of these. You found this confusing too? Choose, oh, the star. And now I'm even more confused. It's backwards. It's backwards? You just got to use one of each symbol. Oh. Oh. Press one symbol to open the box, then spin the dragons to the other two symbols. Does it matter which ones? Well, I guess this, this one, I'll only have this one. No, they both have each. <laughs> okay, that kind of makes sense, but when I say kind of, I mean it doesn't. that goes to don't make me get in the boat just swim nancy what could go wrong swimming in a sea cave i have to get the boat don't i all right let's get the boat uh-oh where am i oh my god oh god ah! Ah! Uh... That's okay. I'm in y'all. I enjoy playing Nancy games so much. And I'm feeling good. Oh, what's my? Oh, I took off my watch, so I don't have an accurate body battery. That's okay. I'm feeling pretty good. That's okay. I love playing video games with y'all. Um, Brit Steps, thank you again for the bits. Hilda Swinson, you have a lot to answer for, but thank you for the bits. And it me, Betty, thank you for the bits too. I appreciate that. Hey, Punchy LaRue. Well, 20 minutes. What was my prediction? At this point, I mean, it's either Will. I. So, 
barista, small business owner. She had her own thing going on, so I, it's not her. I, I personally think it's... I'm gonna go with... I'll go with... <laughs> Well, I don't know. I feel like the fisherman has had more dialogue. Whitney, thank you for the bits. I'm oh, glad you got to be here. Have a good rest of your day. I haven't used this once with bare feet. I've been using this on a boat. Um, I would say... I just don't know if the fisherman has... Not this. Oh my god, did I... This is the same spot I was at, huh? And I can't go this... I can go this way, right? Oh, yeah. Um, I think it's the whale guy. We're gonna say it. Whale guy, because, um, he's a flop. This is the Drew resident. What was that? Please leave a message at the beep. Hi, Hannah. It's Nancy. Listen, I got a little careless and ignored some warning buoys and smashed into some rocks. <laughs> There's a gambling kayak. thing? I'm okay, but Katie's kayak is ruined, and I promised her I'd replace it. So could you do me a big, big, big Wreck. favor and fix Dad his favorite dinner so he's in a good mood? Then have him call me on my cell? Thanks, Hannah. As usual, I owe you one. She's rich. Why does she care? So what did I do wrong? Who can I blame for this? This is the way I went last time, wasn't it? It's gonna take me 20 minutes to get to the sea cave! I, I went straight and straight was into the buoy. Please leave a message at the beep. Not this. Hi, Hannah. It's Nancy. Listen, I got a little careless and ignored some warning buoys and smashed into some the rocks. The furthest while I was green buoy? I'm okay, but Katie's kayak is ruined, and I promised her I'd replace it. So, could you do me a big, big, big favor and fix Dad his favorite dinner? <laughs> what? So Amazing. Then have him call me on my cell. Thanks, Hannah. As usual, I owe you one. Imagine you crash at sea and you're. And what an awful parent who's more worried about. Um, Paying for the boat. Oh. <laughs> this is the Drew residence. Please leave a message. Then whether or not you survived. Hi, Hannah. It's Nancy. Y'all all bet against me, didn't you? I some warning buoys and smashed into some rocks while I was kayaking. All right. I'm okay. Who bet against me? My kayak is ruined, <laughs> and I promised her I'd replace it. So could you do me a big, big, big favor and fix Dad his favorite dinner? All so right. He's in a good mood. Then have him call me on okay. my cell. Okay. Thanks, Hannah. As usual, I owe you one. So don't click forward right here. I should go this way, and I need to go all the way out to the green buoy. Ah, that looks like a cave. We did it, chat. Okay, this wow. is the hole. This must be where Benjamin Hawkins used to hide out. Mama, we're pulling back the curtain on the local history. Wait, how did Benjamin Hawkins make that mechanical lever and all of that? I don't know. Wait, there's some frozen fish. Oops. Not littering. Oh my gosh. Wow. Someone's trained her. She's not wild at all. It tried to kill me. Can I pet it? 
If I get in the boat, as will it here, eat me? I, might as well really oh. check this place out. I said, this is not for me. I'm leaving. Scuba gear. Who's been training the... Not the... I would think this would be Whale Museum. I would think this would... At this point, I think this is Whale Museum. I don't think the fishermen... That piece of driftwood I found must have come from a container just like this one. Firestone! Those must belong <gasps> to Katie! Katie's been training the orca?! Or maybe these were stolen from her boat. But this is all, this is the fish that she has in her freezer. But she didn't trash her own boat, did she? That's gotta be a red herring. Harness series. Oh, mama. This orca is going to a leather convention, mama. <laughs> Camera strap, additional things. I don't know what that is. <gasps> it's just looking at me threateningly. Can I throw the beach ball at it? <gasps> ah! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> So, oh my God, Neon Prawn with the 10 freaking uh. gift subs. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh. I appreciate that so much. Thank you. Thank you. No, we, once again, we have smashed a Hello? sub goal. Hi, Nance. We're bored silly here, so we thought we'd give you a call. What's going on? Great timing, you guys. You will not believe what I just discovered. What? Tell us. For one thing, that orca that's been causing all the trouble around here, it's not wild at all. It's been trained. How do you know? No, I miss her I already. Fetch with it. I'd toss something into the water, and it would use its head to kind of bonk it back to me. Maybe it just picked that up on its own. No, see, I found this hidden sea cave, and in it was this harness-type thing like the military uses on the orcas that it trains. So what do you think it's been trained for? How does she know about the military? Oh, in the cave I also found... I'm pretty sure it has something to do with this, but the caves were also... some cargo containers. In the cave, there were also some cargo containers. They were from the White Chapel Dawn. You think somebody trained the orca to retrieve containers from that ship? I need to stop ago, doing what? Did the orca? The ship have been smuggling something, and people don't usually bother smuggling something unless it's valuable. Who trained it? I'm That's calling the orca know. it? Well, in that hidden sea cave, I came across something else. What? A pair of work gloves. They had Katie's name on them. Oh my gosh, Katie's behind all this? Not necessarily. Those gloves may have been stolen from her. Have you asked her about them? Not oh, yet. Nancy I'm was. way to do that right now. Okay, How do we no. know what know Ginger what the says. Orca is? She says it. I will. Ryan, thank you for the 69 bits. You bet against me. Shock. And uh, Sleigh Bells, thank you for the bits too. I appreciate that. Good to see you. Neon Prawn, thank you once again. I really appreciate it. The game calls the orca a she and Nancy says it. Can we look, can we get some AP style guide? Can we get the AP style guide in here? I'm pretty sure the AP style guide actually says like, um, how you should refer to, oh no. Oh, I don't remember what to do here. How to refer to like pets and uh, different animals. AP style guide. Uh oh. How did I get back to this thing? 
Here we go. Here we go. All right, whoever did the the casino, what's it called? The bet? Are y'all timing it? I hope y'all are timing it. Oh, you better be timing it, Sasha. Oh, you keeping track of prediction. Katie's gone. Just as I suspected, running from the car. If I see her riding on an orca. Wait, she took my fucking stuff. She took my fucking stuff. My suitcase was on. Chase Katie on the orca. We're going to see Katie free willy style riding on that orca. She thought she did her. A, she did us a favor. It was all of our ugly clothing. Be back short. What the? Hot Kettle Cafe. Brittany May, thank you again for the bits. Have the 20 minutes been up? Uh-oh. May Morgan, thank you for the bits, too. Oh, have fun with Skyrim. Great game. Kit Kat Moss, thank Hang you on, for I'll the right bits, you. too. You again? Uh, and Amy says, says Dance, thank you for the first time favor. sub. I appreciate I that so much. Right thank now, you, thank you. For? Do I have to tell him why? It's a long story. Well, it's a long story. He would but love to get her. May or may not be involved in something illegal. I'm not taking my boat out now. It's almost dark. Just call the Coast Guard. I can't. Not until I know what's going on. Just I do can't. it. Not until I know for sure what's going on. I can explain on the way. Look, I'm not going anywhere. And if you know what's good for you, neither are you. Just forget it. Time to steal a forget boat. Forget it. Oh, how am I supposed to I get a boat? You told Holt. Oh, believe me, there's nothing I'd like better than to help you get the goods on Ms. High and Mighty. But I got a cafe to run. Try Andy Jason. I did. He was out of order. Maybe, maybe now he's not out of order. I still think it was him, though. I think he trashed the boat. I just, I don't think it. I no no no. I know what happened. She... She's training the orca, which is bad. But he trashed her boat. She... Yeah? Who had two lines in this whole game? Aunt, this guy? Hi, Nancy. I was hoping you could help me. I was just about to close up shop, but what do you need? So Katie's been feeding the orca, but I think he trashed the boat. It turns out that Katie's been feeding the orca. You're kidding me. Think you could take think me? you could take me for another boat ride? Like right now? And pick up my kayak along the way? Kayak? Are you nuts? It'll be dark in ten minutes. And what about the fog? I need you to take me out one and a half miles due northwest of the lighthouse. Please, this is really important. I can explain on the way. Oh, man. You've got me so curious, there's no way I can say no. You just got yourself a boat ride. Be careful. I'll be waiting right here. <laughs> Not... I'll be waiting right here. Are we gonna... I don't have control over the boat, by the way. <gasps> Are we sneaking onto a ship? Or is this the crash ship? Is this a ghost ship? I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. Some of y'all really want me to hurry because you... Oh, y'all bet the good thing. just brought in the last of the stuff that was stored in the sea cave. Another hour and we'll be out of here. What? If the crew sees me, I'm done for. Oh, don't worry. My mom was a spy. Shh, you hear something? Oh. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a stowaway. 
Well, like I said, my mom was a spy. I'm a flop. It's not my fault. <laughs> Okay. Hello. What are you eating? Beef jerky. Liberated it from that camping supply place. Want some? Still can't believe you robbed those places. Beef the jerky. The boss was supposed to be tied, especially after you hit that cafe. Having that tunnel with all those trap doors and nobody suspecting a thing? It was like being a kid with a key to the candy store. I couldn't help myself. This is where, maybe this is where I got the... What's in the... those? Those look like animal furs. <gasps> Not animal furs. Hey, no snoozing. Boss says this oh, okay, so I'm, person is a I'm real behind behind stuff. Like she's gonna show up out here. I'm just telling you what the boss told me. Now keep your eyes open. Keep your eyes open, Dawn. Careful, Dawn. Hey, I could have sworn I saw something move over there. Oh shit. Oh no. Hold it right there, Missy. This is why she needs like a a knife. <laughs> I don't know, not a knife. You know. <laughs> it ain't the girl detective herself. Yeah, it ain't the girl detective herself. Someone went home with a sore fucking throat from that voice acting experience. Well, I'm hiding right here. You hear something? But I went back to the boxes, I thought. Uh oh. If it ain't the girl detective herself. If it ain't the girl detective herself. We have five minutes left. <laughs> Sounds like a criminal. Well, if it ain't the girl detective herself. I guess I'm supposed to. Oh no. Oh, I'm hiding behind this pole, I guess. Boss has it. Nice of Hilda Nutjob to leave it behind like that, huh? Couldn't have pulled this off without it, that's for sure. Oh, I should have done like the sultry spy music. That's not really spy music, is it? Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, bud. The orca I saw before. Oh no. It got spooky music again. I can't even look at it. Oh yeah, I didn't even figure Katie? Oh my god. Oh! Well, at least she shut up. <laughs> Nancy. I was afraid no one would ever find me. What happened? How did you get here? I fixed my boat and went right out to check on the whale. Only the fog was rolling in and it was getting dark. Then I finally saw her. Only she was being fed by some oh. men in an outboard. Did y'all lose? some sort of harness on her. When they saw me, they rammed my boat, then grabbed me, tied me up, and brought me here. I don't know what's going on. I think I do. <laughs> Quick, give her a haircut. A whale to bring up smuggled cargo from a shipwreck. Shh. Listen. Someone's coming. Hide. Hide. Ah oh, shit. Um. Oh, I guess I hid. Well, <laughs> they don't see me. To know that your friend Nancy will be joining us any minute. Hey, is that Jonas? That gag off? Well, it appears she's already here. All right, where are where you? Where are you, Nancy? Nancy? Where are you, Nancy? Somebody stop her! <laughs> oh, no, I was I'm running! Trapped. Well, what do we have here? Where I knew it was you all you, along, Nancy? and I told Holt and Jenna, if anything happens to me, they'll know you did it. Nice try, but I can smell a bluff a mile away. You're about to become the victim of an unfortunate kayaking accident. Or maybe I'll tell my customers that the snake horse got you. Yeah, that's what I'll do. That's fine. Oh, throw it! <laughs> Say goodnight, Nancy. 
What just happened? Oh, no, oh I don't want to have to hear this man talk again. Well, what do we have here? Well, I knew it was you all I along. was half right. And I told Holt and Jenna, if anything happens to me, they'll know you did it. Nice try. But I can smell a bluff a mile that away. That thing probably weighs You're like 10 pounds. The victim of an unfortunate Two minutes? <gasps> oh! Or maybe I'll tell my customers that the snake horse got you. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Yeah. I mean, surely I'm supposed to throw this at the... Yeah, that's what I thought I did last time. What did you do that for? Say good night, Nancy. Good night, Nancy. <laughs> Nuts. That Way to go, buddy. That was Cartoon Villain 101. <gasps> that was Cartoon Villain 101. Also, he would be dead. That amount of weight to your head? Well, I was wrong about Katie, I guess, but I was Your right head. about Jonas. I gotta hand it to Andy it's Jason. over. The Did I do it? 20 minutes? The smuggled animal furs was a darn good one. First, he got himself an orca that the Russians had trained for covert military operations. Then he made it look like the whale was an orphan so he could hide her in plain sight while she did his dirty work at night. Then Wait, he and what? His Pause. Did he paint the whale to look like an orca? <laughs> did I just get the plot wrong? They disabled Katie's boat to keep her out of their way. They needed work gloves, so they stole hers. In fact, Andy's henchmen couldn't resist using the tunnel they'd found out about in Hilda's notebook to steal practically everything they could get their hands on. But now Andy and his buddies are in jail. Jenna is serving more clam chatter than ever. Katie is planning to vote for Holt after all. The orca is getting along great with a local pod and is rapidly losing interest in humans. And I'm back on the ferry headed home. See you soon, Nancy. P.S. Just before I left. I saw something appear, then quickly disappear in the channel by Katie's boat. She said it was just a log, but I'm pretty sure it was you-know-who saying goodbye. Okay. The game was fun up until she was voting for Holt. Sassy Detective! Finding an Easter egg in recognition, Arakari. Hey, fellow mm. detective. Ever been to a ranch? I haven't, but I've been invited to <laughs> I haven't. It's in Arizona, and it's called Shadow Ranch, and I can't wait to go. You're invited, too. But I should probably warn you, it could be a little dangerous. Aww. Oh my god! I have to record the podcast in like an hour. <laughs> How long have I been streaming? Four hours?! The Secret of Shadow Ranch. <laughs> Not the apologies. Where's my note, apo note app apologies? Rooting for my downfall. Brittany May, thank you for the bits. Hilda Swenson, thank you so much. Fight the Power, thank you again. Dot, thank you for the bits. Emma, thank you for the bits. Last game, I know. I'm upset. There's got to be new Nancy Drews, though. Echolocation, thank you for the bits. Kit Kat Moss, thank you again. And May Morgan, thank you again, too. I appreciate that. So the Russians spray painted a whale to look like an orca, which is actually a fish. And they dropped it off in the bay so that Katie would change her vote. So it was all about the Russians trying to sway the uh, the local election <laughs> is that right holt needed one more vote and that's how they got and that's how they got katie to vote for holt Oh, Gigi, thank you for the bits again. That's what I hear too. I have I have some hope. Who knows? 
Uzi V, thank you for the bits. Neon Gummies, thank you once again. I appreciate that. Brit Steps, thank you once again. May Morgan, thank you so much as well. Kit Kat Moss, thank you for the bits. Oh, ho so I can't believe that was the real plot. <laughs> This game, so this is definitely high up on my rankings. I know I didn't do all the puzzles myself, shockingly. Um, wow, what do I say here? This was the last mainline Nancy Drew game that I hadn't played, aside from the one you can't buy anymore. All we have left is the dossier game. We're going to be playing some Miss Clue. We're going to be playing some Agatha Crispy. Yeah, when did, wait, don't, we're not ending the VOD yet. When did I start? When was the first Nancy Drew Let's Play series? It was Nancy Drew, Tomb, May 23rd, 2021. It's been almost two years. So it's been almost two years. It took almost two years to finish them all on this channel. Um, hi, Close Crew, please don't leave me. <laughs> We're going to be replaying some of them on um, uh, Master Sleuth, a not amateur. What did they call it? Oh, the original Secrets Can Kill. Shoot. Oh, maybe I should do the original one, too. <laughs> not I'm leaving. <laughs> ah! Ah, not I'm leaving. Senior detective, senior sleuth. Yes, that part. Oh, uh, Coziest Ghost, Raven, B23, Cosmos, Neon Prawn, Monica, Kit Kat Moss. Thank y'all all so much. It has really been a wild and fun ride. It really has, Monica. Not get all the trophies. Um, I guess y'all stay tuned because... Wait, only... What's with this poll? Only 78% of people voted that they had fun. Susanna Banana, Laura Lai Kennedy, Emma Howe, Brittany May. Thank y'all so much for the bits. Oh, God, the Vampire Diaries ones. You know what? I'll see what I can do. Bearded Gus, thank you so much for the bits as well. This It feels kind of surreal for it to be over. It honestly does. But it's not. Next week, we will be starting the... the other Nancy Drew dossier game. What's it called? Lights, camera, mystery? Something like that. Um, so I'll be, I will be playing the dossier game. Lights, camera, curses. That's, that's it. And we're going to be, yes, doing them on Senior Detective too. Maybe, I, you know what? After we do the dossier one, I'll see if I can get secrets to kill the not, rem the not remastered one to work. We'll see what we can do. Fiona Lofi, Bats Bun, Coziest Ghost, Heather605, Eric, Cat Havoc, Phlebotanist. Thank y'all so much. Oh, I'll look, I'll check it out, Phlebotanist. And Uzi V, thank you so much too. I appreciate that. The Egypt one was the first one I did. I'll probably replay. I I really do want to replay that one soon. And also Manette, of course. Froggy Girl, thank you so much. Sparkling One, thank you so much, too. Okay, y'all, that's it. I'm going to play the outro. It's going to get not clickbait emotional in here. Thank you so much, Froggy Girl. I appreciate that. Ah, uh, what? Me? <laughs> Fight the power, echolocation, cosmos, raven, Shira. Oh, thank y'all so freaking much. Thank you to everyone who's watched the Nancy Drew Let's Plays. All the Clues crew, y'all have been fucking amazing. Everyone for the bits, donations, subs, gift subs, wonderful Patreon patrons. Y'all are the reason I got to do this for the past two years. We're not stopping. We're still going to be playing some. Stay hydrated. I will see y'all on Thursday with Bratz Forever Diamonds. Take care of yourselves. Jenna, oh my gosh, Jenna, Hilda, thank y'all so much. Kit Kat Moss, I appreciate that. 
Love y'all so much. See y'all on Thursday. Uh, take care of yourselves. Bye. Uh oh. I had to leave before the music ended. Where's the. Uh, huh. Huh.